<laughs> hey, Lois hanging fruit are often the juiciest arcade. Sorry, let me allow me to roll the dice better. <laughs> Thank you. I honestly didn't feel you try trying. missing you more. You didn't ask yeah. me to blow on them for luck once. Jeez. Okay, I'm just no, gonna like say that that was ignored. Because I wanted okay. luck, not <sighs> not spit. <sighs> mm -hmm. Bad breath. Hmm. All of the above. All right. Yeah. So let's give everybody a quick re re recap. Last time on the Lost at Sea. Our heroes had taken up the challenge uh, to assist the nearby uh, the nearby Gekoi village after being discovered by them uh, while they were lost in the ruins after their ship had run aground on the coast of Glaeus. After investigating, they were able to discover that a large primate uh, infected with some sort of strange corruption uh, was accosting uh, the the friendly tree into the uh, representation of nature and after some discussion decided that they would attempt to save the primate the ensuing battle was arduous but landed in the favor of our heroes and as such they were able to purify the beast the beast left with them its blessing and retreated into the forest so Let us begin where we left off. You have just defeated the beast, and your task is complete. Did what anyone did hurt? It? Did anyone take any damage? No. I'm feeling great. Hey, by the way, didn't mean to take your kill from you. I just saw a shot, and I had to take it. He's pointing, pointing at Coots. Oh, it's okay. I'll never forgive you, but I understand. Why can you roll that? Can you roll that first part back a little bit? Um. Yeah. No. It, it, I'll just never forgive you. But it's okay. Editor's note: He didn't. Is Mori still wearing my trash armor that I imbued him with? Uh, for a little bit longer. Okay. Yeah. How long does that last? Uh, one minute. So like, it'll be on for a couple more seconds. Looking good, Mori. I appreciate your assistance. It was quite useful. <laughs> The trash always is. I'm gonna hand the the magic mace over to Stinkler. Mm. Oh. Now this has been in my family for generations. The, so the monkey left. Treat this the weapon with respect. What do you? I've had this for yeah, did, thousands, hundreds of years. I'm sorry. Uh, uh, yeah, didn't he, didn't you just get that Goker like, like maybe to, I, five seconds I, ago? We all saw you pick it up with your tongue. He, yeah, thanks for backing. Yeah, we definitely saw you pick it up with your tongue and went, and it like shot out. Wait, hold that on, that a, might, that that might a be tree a random. Branch. That might be a random stick he brought from the woods. Check it. That was a tree branch that you saw drop. <laughs> uh, okay, sorry. So you think that us seeing your tongue dart out to pick up that hammer was a, a, actually a tree branch falling? Yeah. I I think I he might be joking. Oh, that makes sense. Hmm. Okay. Well, thank you for the mace anyway. I will cherish it just like your ancestors before you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Oh, God. <laughs> All right. Well, you now have uh, Goker's ancestral mace. Son of a. <laughs> Through his family, if, for as long as he can remember. Yeah, as long as I can which remember, was like five minutes. Last five minutes. Mm. Yeah, it was not that long of a memory problem. It's been in my family for over 60 seconds. For over 60 seconds? Damn, That's usually a people lot are, of seconds. People, people are gone in that, usually. Mm. Blink and you might miss it. Alrighty. Anything else you would like to do while you're here? Uh, I Actually, I would like to inspect the tree that he was looking at. He was feasting okay. upon. Go ahead. I'm not on the map. Oh, here, let me adjust everything. <laughs>
Oh. <laughs> no. No, not at all. But it it's, offers it's, us so many things. Don't you love your all the choices you have out there? <laughs> yeah, that's true. I guess that's, that's so true. Okay. That was really strange. Mm-hmm. Um, we're back? Yeah, we're back, yeah. but now your faces aren't showing up. <gasps> oh, oh, no. Mm. Oh, that's because, that's because it's the wrong... <laughs> Okay. It's the, I was gonna. Let me <laughs> let me fix this. Hey, hey there, girls. I'm, I'm still seeing my wrong world. Hey, oh, buddy. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I don't know why this I can never catch a break. Oh my god. Yep, 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 yep. Okay, I think we're good. Before we get to ask, uh, leveling yeah. up to level two, do I get any additional spells, or is it yes, just sir? The One extra additional spell for first level. Yes. We and do. you also get leans in, whispers elegantly in ear. You get access to your sorcerer, uh, your uh, sorcerer's font. Oh fuck yeah! So, uh, where can I find? Or font of font of magic. Excuse me. Uh, here, I'll just link this to you. Two big choices you'll have to make before we get into the next combat. Uh, moist is uh, which of your meta magics? I sent it to you directly. Which of your uh, meta magics you're going to choose? Okay. See, uh, because when you get font, or excuse me, you don't get meta magic yet, but it's a good thing to keep in mind on what meta magics you want to pick because right now you just get a font of energy which lets you cast more, but that font later lets you spend it for meta magic, which can really define what your character actually uses. So. To give you an idea, one of the meta magics is Twin Spell, which is if you cast the spell Haste, which normally only targets one ally, and gives them the Haste buff, which is one of the most powerful buffs in the game, uh, Twin Spell would let you put that on two people, but that's one of your choices. Uh, another another powerful meta magic is Quicken Spell, which lets you cast a action spell as a bonus action, and Sorcerers in my game are the only ones that can double cast, cast two spells Ooh. at once. So. That's something to keep in mind as well. Two leveled spells, which means two chances for wild magic to proc. All right, fuck yeah. So, so to be clear, fuck. this level you get font of magic. Okay, that's, that's what you get. Uh, I believe I get channel divinity. Yep, you get channel divinity. Uh, I believe Coots gets. I get another divine domain feature. Oh, Coots gets something. Right, Coots yeah. does get something. Coots gets key. This is when you yeah. actually turn into a monk. Uh, key what? is a pool of mystical energy that you use uh, to channel through your body, which can give you all sorts of cool stuff. Dude, you can release your Riatsu. Yep. The three abilities that you start with are Flurry of Bo uh, Blows, uh, Patient Defense, and Step of the Wind. And you have two key, and each of those abilities costs one key. I have two key every every fight? How, how does my key... Uh, you have two key until you replenish it. Uh, key is replenished whenever you take a... I believe it's long rest, but let me check. Oh, never mind. You get your key during a short rest. So, basically, once a fight, if you rest between fights. So it was Fury of Blows, Step, Step, Step Row. Yeah, I'll just I'll I'll copy paste it for you. Sure, yeah, it works. Yeah, here's your here's your shorthand. I'll put it in a uh, Lost Sea Chat in the Discord. Okay. There you go. Those are your three options. And you have two. You have two key, and you get and each of those costs one key. All right. And as for everybody else's level up, uh, Goker, you get access to Song of Rest. I believe I remember us talking about that. Uh, Jack of all trades, which is already automatically tracked. Um, and you get another spell. And you get uh, Mori. You get a uh, Fighting Spirit. This level. As yes. a samurai, which is sick, nasty, cool. It is. I assume that's the, the action surge replacement, correct? Uh, yes. Well, focus is the action surge replacement, but instead of getting second wind, you get fighting spirit, which is what the subclass of samurai normally gets in normal mm -hmm. fighter, which is um, you gain five temporary hit points and advantage on all your attacks. And you can do I'll that three times a combat, baby. It's pretty yeah, good. Per long rest, which is nice. Yeah, that's very cool. Yes. Wait, where is Durst? Oh, there he is. Durst is right here, and he has a thirst. All right, so that should be more magic. a quick review of everybody's levels. Cool. And... 
So I have a, sorry, it says here I have another divine domain uh, feature. I don't know what that is. Uh, at least Perfect. it says that on the book. What, what level are you looking at? Level two. You should have channel divinity. Channel divinity and divine domain feet. That's what it says. But we can just go with channel divinity. Divine domain feet. Your divine domain feature should be at third. No, it's not. There's nothing at third, actually. That's the wild thing. They put divine... Oh, uh, I'm sorry. I'm looking at this weird... Okay, now the chart. Yeah, no, no, no. I no, thought no, I was no. going... I'm no, no, no. You're right, you're right, you're right, you're right. You, you get... Yeah, and that should be listed underneath the domains on the World Anvil. Oh, uh, okay. I'll, I'll need to grab that link then. Okay. Sweet. Good, good, good. Uh, yes. Oh, do you need me to get that for you? Yeah, totally do. Okay, I'll grab that for you real quick. Thank you so much. Kindly DM Sama. I'm, I'm sprinting. I'm running. I'm... Looking. Master. Classes. Uh, what are you, coin? Yes. Okay. One moment, please. In cover. Dun, 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 All right, here you go. Thank you so kindly. There you go. Beautiful. Thank you. I believe at second level you get uh, channel divinity... Make it rain. Yeah, that's it. I got make it rain. Yep, make it rain. Make that's it an rain. Action. You, can you can present your holy symbol, and if you do, you can pay up to 1,000 gold pieces. You heal yourself and your allies within 20 feet by one hit for every 100 gold piece you spend. I'm sorry, guys. I'm broke as shit. I'm broke as shit, guys. I'm sorry. Lies. I'm sorry. <laughs> make it rain gets really good later. Oh, I can imagine. And it scales up. All right, here we go. Boop, 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 ba, da, boop, boop. Okay, so uh, you guys wanted to investigate this? I, I think I've made my decision on uh, the next level one spell. Okay, which spell is that? Uh, I'm thinking Grease. That is a very good spell. Yeah, yeah. it sounds good. It's so thematically in line with my character. I love it. I have used Grease before in the past as that spell. Can you send me the link to the spells again? Yeah, I got you. I got you, bud. Okay. Here's the link for the spells. Do um, you remember how to use the filter system? Yeah. Okay. Here. Yeah, you're forgetting your name is Donsley in here. <laughs> I call them the donks. There you go, bud. Thanks. He's just a doggy. Dunk on him. All right. All right, let's see. Got all that. Good, 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 good. This pleases me. All right, let's do this. So, Durst, as you approach the, uh, the, the dead treant, Unfortunately, you were not able to get here in time to save it. But make me an Arcana check. I will. Oh, there it is. 18. Nicely rolled. Okay. Very much. As you get closer to the tree. Uh, so, let me describe this to you. The tree it has a vaguely humanoid form, but it's where its chest would be has been ripped open. And it's just been consumed from the inside. Now, the treant doesn't have organs like that, but it has internal mechanisms. As you know, They're not organs, but they're just the insides of it. And it's been eaten out. Now, here's the thing that gets kind of disturbing. It's that the, the wood has been eaten and chewed on and torn to pieces. But it doesn't look like that the creature actually ate anything. It just chewed it. You see that there is a large pile of uh, of wet sawdust, basically at the bottom, where all of it's just been kind of chewed and 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 just spewed out. You also see that there is a thin line of vomit that also kind of covers the the wooden sludge pile, meaning that the creature was throwing up this need to eat this. It's completely, and 
utterly wrong because it, it it would indicate that the creature wasn't even feeding off of it. It was just destroying it. Hey, uh, yeah, that monkey thing wasn't even eating this thing. It was just trying to kill the tree. Take a look at this. Durst kind of signals for everyone to come over and motions with his hand. Yep, yep. Oh, God, Stinkler. Mm. Oh. Well, he no, was look definitely right. evil. Definitely oh. evil monkey. Yeah. Luckily, we saved him from the path of corruption. Oh. Yeah. I thought he seemed kind of sweet. Well, the thing about this is, look at this. It was ripping off, spitting out, and vomiting. Like, it didn't even look like it wanted to do this. It was just doing it. And it killed that damn tree. Yeah. We can't completely rule out the fact that the tree prompted this. Maybe it even deserved it. <laughs> nope. Truly innocent. It could have been an evil tree. That's really true. Hey, we should, I, we let's check his wallet. Let's check his wallet. Oh, yeah. Check his wallet. The, the tree does... The tree does not have a wallet. Damn. Nor material possessions. And now not even dignity. Mm. Damn. Uh, Arcadum, question. Is this tree different than most of the other trees that we've seen in the forest? Well, if you recall, um, there is a tree like it in the center of the village of the Gekoi. And okay. there's also uh, there yeah. was also a few of them that you saw whenever you were walking through the forest that I described briefly. But this one is different because it appears to be older than the others. Or at least it was. And it's very close to death? Oh, no, it's gone. It's, it's all. Oh, it is gone. It's gone. Yeah. Oh. Can, uh, be, before I forget, can I? Did you already tell us about the weapon that I have, or is that something that I'll need to like? You'll have to identify of... it. Okay. How do I do that? Uh, it takes an Arcana check, or you need to find a specialist to tell you. Okay. Can I try the Arcana check? Sure can. Okay. I'll give that a whirl. Drum roll. Ah. Oh, okay. Not okay, this time. Process. Uh, uh, um, can Durst see that he, Stinkler's trying to look at that and Durst is like, come on, are you trying to see if that's magical? Wait, yes. don't look down at like a pool cue. Uh, Durst takes it out of his hands and barely holds it up. <clears throat> Durst is going to try and do an arcana on it as well. Okay. Ah, 17. Oh. Alrighty then. Now I believe uh, I told you guys it was a plus one last time. Uh, this would confirm mm -hmm. that. However, there's something else as well. Upon further inspection, it seems that this weapon, although it is pulsing with druidic magic, it is actually um, a, a, a weapon that leans more towards um, the palladic energy, so like paladins and like order and law and, and good. It is a plus one Great Maul. This is a hell of a weapon. Hell, if it was smaller, I'd use it. This is a great, great mace. Paladins can kind of use it from time to time. It's dripping with druidic magic for whatever reason. But I don't know, this is a weird one. One of a kind, really. So, uh, how about her, Stinkler? Oh, well, thank you. I'm glad that you were able to sniff that all out for me. I know, I got an eye. Uh, for so, expensive things. Now, what do you gentlemen think? Should we take a piece of the tree with us for proof of its death? Listen, I was going to say, does anyone have a bag? I want to take part of this guy. What if yeah. What if we, like, is there like a branch that's already broken off? Maybe we can just like grab that. Because the monkey probably knocked a few off. We don't have to like take more away. I'll just, I'll just chomp a chunk off with my teeth. Yeah, we can just blame it on Goker. That's a good we idea. We are the demons now. <laughs> <laughs> All right. The Goker start starts, on it. starts chewing a, a branch of the tree off. Uh, let's see here. All right. You have a treant branch. Nice. Right. Uh, this is a crafting material. What? Whoa. It, can be, it can be used to create uh, a weapon or armor. Uh, even though it is one branch, um, I, do, I do most of my um, measurements and calculations for crafting as stocks it's just a catch-all measurement term so you would have mm -hmm. one stock of treant branch uh, of treant branch so, so we don't need like more so so basically you have enough stock to make one normal sized weapon or one set of armor 
Gotcha. Oh. Yeah, I just use that as a quick way to measure it. Just chop this whole tree. Up. Can we just chop? Can we just chop away? Well, you can. Yes. <laughs> I knew it. I knew it. Do you wish to do that? Uh, Goku, would you want to go for maybe another bite? I, ah, I right. so, we, so we don't feel <laughs> terrible. So we don't feel terrible. Let me perform last rites. Amen. What, what's last rites? I just want to follow along. <laughs> They just like we thank you, oh higher beings, for this bounty of this dead body. Thank you. All right, move on. All right, yeah, go 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 for it, Goku. Get take some real big bites. Okay, going to town on that. All right. The party decides to steal the kill here, Durst. What's up? Nothing. The party decides to harvest the corpse of the treant. You are given a total of five stocks. Oh, of five branches. stocks. Nice. I ain't dropping. I'm holding. You also notice that the juridic power of the uh, of the Great Mall fades. Oh, oh shit. <laughs> Hold uh -oh. on. Hold on. Hear me out. Put I'm the sorry. Wood back. Put the wood back. <laughs> Taco. Uh, we're good, right? We did the little prayer thing, right? Well, I don't think so. It seems when we desecrated its corpse, we've lost its magical element to this weapon. They must have been connected through the ether. Yeah. Probably should have chopped it up either. That probably was a bad idea. Oh, well. <laughs> well, well, well. If it isn't the consequences of my actions. Mm. It's still a very heavy item, though. It should still be fine. Yeah, just just li li live and learn is what I always say. And he tastes good. Oh, no, <laughs> he's got a taste for it now. Damn it, again. All right. Well, you've got your stocks of Maury's just going to sigh. <laughs> I guess I'll just uh, go ahead and... I'll just give me a second here. I'm just gonna, just gonna go ahead and do this now. Oh, holy! It's gone. Y yes, you turned him into supplies. We have him with us, Joker. He's never truly gone. That's true. That is. I true. was gonna say, that's, is was that's what anybody wa wanted. Durst wants to look around while we're doing. Did we find any acorns or any kind of seeds from this tree on the ground? Uh, let's see here. I could probably give you a chance to find some of that. Ah. I'll do 20 or lower. Not today. Damn! Can Coots look for some seeds? Perhaps his smaller frame? Mm, all right, one more. 20 or lower. Let's go! Not today. Go! <laughs> now, Durst is the searcher. We... <laughs> Two is all you get, slams table. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, sorry. Um, but I'm paying for the pizza. Oh my god. <laughs> that guy <laughs> that guy sits at the back of the table. Should we try and figure out where the monkey came from? You sure can. That's a survival check to try and follow its tracks. Okay, I'll give it a whirl. Ah <laughs> Stinkler yeah. believes that he can't find himself. <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. Do you survival check, you just die on the spot. <laughs> <laughs> I always believe a natural one survival means they're just gone. He, he, he fades from memory. Yeah, I yeah. just get lost on my own. It's just the end of Final Fantasy X. <laughs> Stinkler lost his smell. It's worse. It's 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 Doctor it's Doctor Manhattan on Mars in Watchmen. Well, I, I think I had a good idea. If anyone else thinks they might have a better <laughs> chance. You know what? I, I I think I'll give it a shot. Let's see where this this big old monkey man came from. I thought that was another one. I was like, the entire party dies. <laughs> from a survival check? <laughs> no, it's, pull, it's just funny. Pull up in Resident Evil, you You have died. discovered the entire party was dead the whole time. <laughs> Is that enough for any info? Uh, with an 11, you're able to detect that the tracks seem to venture in this direction. Thankfully, they are big monkey tracks, so they're not that hard to see. Stinkler, however, must have had something in his eye. 
Uh, Stinkler, I don't, I don't know how you missed this, man, but there's giant monkey footprints <laughs> right under you, and I think that's where he came from. No, you're lying. You, you you're lying. You don't know. You don't. Stink. You still don't see them? They're I'm like massive. Huge. <laughs> yeah, like, I mean, could be I'm from anything. Bro, oh, they're right there. Okay, okay, okay. okay. So, could literally so, be from anything. Please. Okay, so, so, so Durst gets on, just starts crawling on top of Coot's shoulders, grabs a hold of the shoulders, of just the shoulders of Stinkler. The monkey was real. It was real. I wouldn't try. These tracks could be placed here by a villain trying to lure oh. us into a trap. Oh. <laughs> Falls off the shoulders. Oh no. If, if I might ask, why are we giving pursuit to the monkey? Well, we, there could be more of them. Yeah. We Maybe want we to find like ten of them. I did notice that when uh, when Durst's hat fell in the river, there was like black stuff in the river, and it was that must have been coming from upstream the river. So perhaps what? there's something that way. So you believe the monkeys are polluting the water with oil, or what do you think the black stuff is? Yeah, I'm thinking that it's definitely like monkeys are like, they got the central water supply and they're shooting out their magic juice. Ah, uh, I see. It. We have, that we'd have a far fetch, but I'll follow it. Uh, do you think maybe we should clear our tracks here in case anyone's like, hey, who who killed this tree? Maybe we could, so we, <laughs> we could just make sure that no one can trace it back to us. You know, that's actually a great idea, Coots. I like it. Oh, my God. Thank you, Coots. Coots, we did not kill the tree. It was dead when we found it. No, 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 no. They're going to come across a tree that's covered to pieces. Okay? They're going to assume. There's giant bike marks right here from Goker, and I feel like they would probably put two and two together that the monkey didn't do it, and it said Goker's big mouth did. I don't know. And I did sign my name. What if we just put a... (laughs) (laughs) I left my business card on the body. Yeah, it's a Joker card. Let's let's leave a sign in that says monkey did this, not anyone else. Yeah. Yeah. That's confusing. You know what they say, monkey see, monkey do, right? (laughs) I'll I'll put... Who says that? I'll write it down. I'll put monkey killed tree... No one else, all caps. <laughs> Goker was I, Goker was oh, here. Oh. Monkey kill tree. No one else okay, did. Wait, wait a minute. <laughs> Underline that so they know we mean it. Oh, okay, okay. Hold on. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Make sure to add the hashtag. <laughs> mm-hmm, mm-hmm. All right. It's. I think it's. I think we're good now. So this oh. is how Twitter started. In the US. Let's just put a QR code on this, and we're golden. <laughs> Monkeys have no morals anyway. Mm-hmm. Man, that is true. A lawless land. So we're going to track these creatures to find out what's happening upstream is that correct well that was my thought process but if you have a better idea maury i i'm down for anything to be honest i'm just happy to have this new mace i am concerned about what happened with this tree and i wonder if it might be more prudent to alert the villages to what we have found first ah that, that makes sense and then we could all rest and recuperate i believe my magic is a bit tired at the moment they owe us a bunch of money too true we still need the payment a giant snake tried to kill me. Yeah. Oh, God, we should get a bonus today. for that. <laughs> Maybe we should go back because we don't have that much food to the village we for a bit. We have about one. Exactly. Thank you, Coots. We yeah, I think one it's... day's worth of food. Well, let's do it. Let's go back real quick and I agree. give them a quick update. I mean, Whoever we suggested all... following the monkey is a goddamn idiot. Yeah, it's probably Joker. It was. It was. <laughs> it, just, it just. Durst is just pointing. But it was. Oh, my God. What falls after? You must gather your party before venturing forth. Can we leave one of them behind if we really want to, though? No. You must Damn. gather your party. Bye, Mori. Okay. And the party decides to return to the village. Do we have a quick moment to take a tinkle? Yeah, go ahead. Yeah, I'll be right back. Tinkle time! Tinkle, tinkle. Tinkle, tinkle, little star. God, I love D and D. Right? It's so good, dude. That is not how I was expecting this to start, but we off and running. Uh you know what, dude? Just you expect the unexpected, right? Uh, I, I uh, hate you. We're on break. I can get away with it. I hate you. <laughs> I want you to know that. Don't say that. Wait. Yeah, you should actually. You know what you did. I know. We're there. 
Oh, this guy. This guy's class. Oh, here we go. Oh no, he's he's crossed with us already. Not please. A lot of people really like claps too much. I got a lot of I got a lot of comments about claps too much. <laughs> there he goes again. <laughs> Give him the claps, boss. Give him the clamps. Give him the clamps. Yeah, I'll give him clamps. Yeah, we're doing a wobber yeah. mouth now, eh? Cool. Yeah, favor, yeah. favor, Delicious. favor. Hey, favor. I'm gonna need you to back up from the elders, okay? As you all know, I am a, I am a police officer, Peter. Yep. Ah, oh, welcome back, travel. Welcome back. <sighs> all right. It's my line. My line. Thanks. Thanks for playing in my game, guys. <laughs> no, thank, thank, you for for having us on, our, thank you for having us in this game. <laughs> man. Oh, yeah. It's all coming uh, together. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. It's all, it's coming, all coming together. together. <laughs> some, of the, some of the best Walburton lines were in that movie. Oh, no, by all accounts, it doesn't make any sense. <laughs> yes. Uh, boys are for Goose Girl. Goose Girl's boys. Boys, boys. Boys for Goose Girl. The one is when he's running away. Do 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 it seems that you have returned. I hope with good news. The tree is dead. Uh, well, well uh, mo more importantly, uh, we we found a, a giant. Um, how would we describe this monkey, guys? Very sweet. Yeah. One of the sweetest monkeys yeah. I've ever seen. Well, I, I was gonna say corrupted by evil, but I was gonna sweet, say a little bit evil. Sweet corrupted by evil monkey that uh, appeared to have attacked the tree, but we did manage to um, re lift its curse. A monkey was spared of whatever the F ailment, the darkness you've been talking about, has freed its spirit, at least. We managed to do that, but a prod from, a, I'm very sorry to say there was a casualty. The tree itself. Uh, there's nothing we can do. We were there too late. We, we tried like everything to save it. I understand. We had feared the worst, but it seems yet another village has been lost to this corruption. Did this creature have a white mane? Do you guys yes. Yes. Yeah, 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 yeah. It was white. Yes. It's so yep. white. Mm -hmm. I was thinking. Then it seems that you have done a service to us. White Fury has long been our protector of Green Bamboo. By freeing its soul, it shall be able to attend to us once more. Did you see him come back? Because after we freed him, he kind of took off. No doubt he is already going to save those that he can. We right. will see him eventually. But I so can tell... There's no stress to track him down? Yeah, no, he's a good guy. He'll be fine. I can tell from your honest visages that it seems <laughs> that my initial distrust of you was misplaced. I apologize, but the corruption has put us all on edge. There has also been reports of eclipse in the area. History check. Do you know what that is? Yeah. Yeah, that'd be great. History oh, check. That'd be wonderful. Oh. Ooh, that's a hot roll. All right, Stinkler. That looks like the biggest one so far. What else we got? John can shoot. Couple of elevens. <laughs> <All right. laughs> Thanks, Durst. All right, Stinkler. Uh, although your party is from Calcatesh, uh, you have heard some things. Uh, about this continent. One of the things that you heard is that within the last 20 or 30 years or so, a massive uh, sort of uh, war band led by a powerful tyrannical daimyo conquered the eastern kingdoms and brought all of them under a singular rule. This clan or country as it portrays itself to be now, this kingdom is known as the Eclipse. 
servants of the dark side of the moon, as the rumors would state. The Eclipse are known to uh, be quite ruthless and tyrannical. In fact, they are one of the reasons why uh, so many of the northern and southern clans are on edge and why each looks to their neighbor, not for just opportunity ambition, but also of fear and protection. Are they also Gekoi? Uh, no. The Eclipse is, well, the Eclipse is multiracial. Ah. Uh. It's, a, it's, it's more of a um, country. It's okay, a, it's I see. A, basically, um, essentially, the how things work in Glaeus is um, it's based loosely off of um, War of the Three Kingdoms, you know, in feudal Japan kind of setup, where there are many different small, major family clans which act as city states that all kind of fight over you know resources, power, land, things like that, and they constantly shift in strength back and forth, conquering each other. Uh, one such individual, however, was able to accomplish this very difficult task for the eastern kingdoms and now all of the other kingdoms look to it in fear as of right now this is something you do know um there is a tumultuous peace held in check by Azalon, the archmage of glaeus but there is a whisper of war on the wind bum bum bum, bum. all right and that's what you that's that's how you know that this is concerning to the Gekoi because not only is are the eclipse this far west but any ver, any person of the eclipse will carry with them a lot of power uh, mm. both they might actually have and what they could call upon basically they're the tyrannical evil powerful country and why would they be here and that concerns everyone and bright eyes will continue and say the Eclipse has been known to employ spies, and no offense meant you do not look as if you belong here. <laughs> but, as it were, you have proven your loyalty, and that you are good of heart. So, if you might give me a moment of your time, I would like to discuss with you a far greater matter. Yes. Well, I'll be honest, I don't have no idea where I would go outside of this, so I'm with you guys till we get out of this gig. All right, he will gesture towards the large roots, which kind of transform themselves into a table by the by the treant. It's kind of badass. Claps, could you gather some refreshments? I want to imagine Goker just sat on the table. <laughs> <laughs> Goker, I think you're supposed to sit in one of the chairs around the table. All right. Uh, Claps will return and we'll give out refreshments to everyone. And then Bright Eyes will lean forward and then he will say, Now, I promised you payment and it will be provided. Um, you will find it in your rooms that I have accommodated you. I have also taken the liberty of gathering some supplies for you and you may also purchase additional ones that you like i wish i could give you more but i must care for my people and now we bring it to the matter at hand there is a concern that i and the other village heads have had not only have we been disappearing entire villages of gekoi disappearing in the night but not by the mist by something else we suspect that the presence of the Eclipse has something to do with it, although we do not know for certain. The reports from my scouts have indicated that there is a small encampment by a massive ruin to the north uh, east of this, of, of this location. Now, these ruins were once part of the Bramblewood, uh, an ancient place where... Hmm, more sinister yokai once made their home before they were purged by Azalon many years ago. Until as such, the Bramblewood has been more or less abandoned. All creatures have grown back all around it, and it became a place of peace once more. But any such peace is temporary at best, it would seem. I would like to task you to investigate this ruins 
find out why the Eclipse are interested in it, and to bring back any reports that you might have. If possible, if you could explore the ruins further inside, it is rumored that Azalon left supplies there, powerful artifacts uh, that he would use as a forward operating base. Although it would seem that his attentions in Kalkatesh drew him away from this. But regardless of that, the Spire of Glaeus has nodes of strength and power throughout the continent. Discovery of one of these could give us an edge in facing this threat, if you can find it. I'm in. <laughs> oh! Oh! Ancient temple? You need a cleric with you. Well, if Stinkler's in, I'm in. <sighs> ah, come on! Go, 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 come on! There's money to be made! Yeah, uh, what, uh, what if there's a fun monkey you can talk to? Alright. Like monkeys. <laughs> just think, Oker, if it's terrible, you can leave and go, wow, that was bad. I was right. Yeah, that is good. That's mm. a good point. Maury's awfully quiet. You see him kind of very introspective. Coots kind of thinking to himself. These lands are my home. If they are threatened, I will defend them. You're so cool. I know. <laughs> <laughs> Cool the first shit. acknowledged it. All right. In that case, uh, Bright Eyes will nod. Very good. I shall see that you are supplied. Um, if you'd like, I could prepare the shops that you might be able to spend the gold that I can provide to you. Or we can just trade it for those supplies with no I, markup. I'll, as a businessman, I would like to check out the local establishments. And as a man of fun, I would like to ask, do you have brothels in this village? Yes. <laughs> we oh, have no. a, we have a foreigner's brothel for you if you'd like. Hot damn! Enjoy your business, Durst, fool. Damn it! <laughs> I have another question for you, Bright Eyes. Yes. We were able to recover small traces of the tree. I'm curious if you have any craftspeople that can work with that kind of wood. Bright Eyes will look up to the tree ant behind him. If you have recovered the tree ant's branches, I am sure that his kin would like to have them back. God damn it. Son of a bitch, Maury. We didn't, we only, we, we didn't get that much, right, Maury? How much? Yeah, we, only, we only found one branch. It was like one, st I would call it a stack of them, maybe. One stack. Uh, of a single branch. Fold it over itself. It was, we found a single branch. Yeah, yeah, one stack that has one branch in the stack specifically. Yep. Right, Maury? <laughs> you just hear the desperation. <laughs> right? <laughs> Maury will give. Uh... <laughs> oh my gosh. Uh, Maury will give Stinkler a very long look. Give him what you found. Unfortunately, this is all we could find. It's it's not much, but I would like his kin to have it so they have just a little piece of him to remember him, remember him by. It's right. just one of the branches, and we four left then. Bright Eyes will take the stock and will offer it to the treant, whose roots will reach out and grasp it. The treant will look at it with a long and mournful face, and then it will speak for the first time. <laughs> and it will speak to Bright Eyes, who will nod. He says that the remembrance of his kin is appreciated. But it would be better that those that avenged him carried them with him. He can make it into something for you, if you'd like. Oh, fuck. God damn it. Um, that would be awesome. Now... Out of curiosity, if he were to, if we were to find more somehow, would he be able to make more tools? Bright eyes will look up at the trant. The trant will nod sadly. Indeed. I'm gonna find... go check dumpsters <laughs> later. Can, can, I think. can Durst just high five Coots real quick? Just like. 
Bright Eyes will then uh, look down with solemn eyes and will simply say, If you are able to recover any more of his kin, he would gladly make something of them for you, that you might continue to survive in their stead. You bring them well, justice, after all. Don't got no more here, but yeah, maybe maybe later we'll find some more or something like that or something. Mori is going to stand up. Actually, I found four more pieces. I snuck them into your trash can. They should still be there. Oh my good heavens. <laughs> yeah, wow. He's Maury's right. Here here we go. So weird that you didn't notice they were in your trash can. Bright, bright so eyes will look at all of you incredulously. <laughs> Claps too much will will smile, saying as you have four more? Will, That's good news. He will, he will yeah, congratulate you news. with clapping. Bright Eyes will close his eyes and just <sighs> take the stock and offer it up to the treant. The treant, who is too saddened by the presence of more yet of his kin, will take them as well. What would you like him to make for you? I kind of want a really awesome short sword, like a really good one. What about like a like a, a helicopter? What? Yeah. All right. Uh, well, I guess my idea seems stupid now compared to a helicopter. <laughs> okay, so <laughs> a goddamn shield of some sort would be great. And like guns, big guns. Oh yeah yeah yeah. Oh maybe a maybe a. Could you make something to help me fly? Well, that'd helicopter. be a helicopter. <laughs> helicopter gun. Bright bright bright, bright eyes this. will will shine with his eyes, and he will say. I believe that you do not have kites, yes? No, no we don't. We don't get that. Not, not a single kite. If you would like, he can make kites for you. That way you may be able to travel our lands. What do oh. we think? Yeah, what do we think? Do we want something like for travel or do we want something more to be used in combat? What are you boys feeling? I want a kite. I've always wanted to have a kite. So I, I have a question above game. Mm. Because the winds have been so erratic, do we even know if the kites will come in handy or have the winds calmed down like since we've gotten back to the village? Uh, the winds have calmed since you've got back to the village. Okay. So then I won't even need a kite because I can just poof. You can fly. Yeah. Correct. So at the very least, we have one extra piece that somebody could use. Yeah, I feel like maybe using them more for something in battle might be what I'd prefer. So I'll try and think of something to be... I, I would say maybe if you want... So here's what I'll say. If you guys want to all get weapons for yourself, Mori can get the kite for Coots. Or if Coots wants to get something, then he can also get a weapon with Mori's thing. But well, I will you give not Coots... get your own yeah. weapon? Huh? Should you not get your own weapon? I could, but in character, Mori would get you a kite. Mm. It's kind of badass. Yeah, so it's totally up to you. But if you guys all want to get weapons, Mori will get a kite for Coots. I'm pretty good on weapons since I have the uh, monkey mace. Would it be possible to turn one of those into a shield for a jurist? Uh, the, oh. the stocks can be turned into a shield, armor, a weapon, or a tool. Or uh, a kite. So we each have one to use then. Maybe I should get a shield. I'll probably go with armor then at that point. I think I have the highest HP pool, right? So armor would make sense. Hmm. Okay. Can I get a combo staff kite? Are you thinking like Aang from Avatar? <laughs> Straight up from Aang. Yeah. Uh, that would actually be really good. Uh, that is a trick weapon. Uh, you can get that made if you'd like. Although you will need special training to use it. Where do I get the special training? You'll have to actually train story-wise. Like you'll have to find somebody who knows how to fight with those and then train with them. But the a staff kite is an actual trick weapon. Okay. But I would not need training for a regular kite. No. Yeah, I'll do that. Which one? It's combo staff kite. Because I, I would do I need training to fly or to attack? Well, with it? you you do need training to fly, but you're you're gonna learn that from Mori. So I was gonna say okay. I got you, kid. So so I, I I would have a basically a kite that could act as a staff if I had the training, but one day I could get the training for, it, but it's still a kite. Yes, sir. That works for me. All right, I'll make nope. you a staff kite. 
All right, I got uh, four four left. Yeah, I'm gonna go with that shield. I need that shield for Durst. Alrighty, shield. Three mm -hmm. left. Should I get a shield or a dagger? I thought you had a dagger. Yeah, but maybe I can get a better one. That's true, you could dual wield. Dual wielding. Is that good to do? <laughs> if uh, you're a rogue. <laughs> okay. <laughs> dual, okay, so to, to answer your question, Donkey, um, dual wielding allows you to make an attack with your with your bonus action, uh, but the attack does not add your modifier without a fighting style or other support. So it's a right. it's a very weak side attack, but it is a secondary attack. All right. Uh, how does the shield work? Uh, the shield is a straight bonus to your armor class, making it more difficult for you to be struck in combat. I just go for a shield. All righty. Now, using armor as a sorcerer, does that come with any drawbacks? Uh, you don't have proficiency in armor, which means that uh, uh, you'll take certain disadvantages on things if you wear it without uh, proficiency. Well, that's no good then. Can I... Uh, hmm. hmm. Maybe I'll use it for a tool then, because there's no reason... Like, I, I couldn't make like a wand out of it to make my shit stronger, could I? Or is that, does that exist? Yeah. Oh, well, that makes more sense. Then I'll do a wand. You, you can make a foci, specifically, which is a uh, which is an implement that you use to cast through. And that would just be like a... How does that work? Is that just like an upgrade to like how well, frequently my thing each of these, um, each of these... Okay, so now I can explain what the Treant Branch's like special properties are. They will not start off as magic weapons or armor or anything, but they are very light. So that's their, that's their initial perk. So... Uh, you don't take any stealth penalties using them. Uh, they basically weigh one pound. They're very, very light. However, as time goes on, these um, these tools and weapons and, and things like that, as you gain experience and as you progress, and with each passing day, your natural life force will leak into them and they will eventually develop magical properties. They, they grow with you in a quite literal sense. Well, that definitely sounds better then. So, yeah, I think like a cool, what was it, foci? A foci. Uh, okay, so you have uh, set the, you have three foci you can get. There is a gnarled branch, a vine gauntlet, or a wooden mask. Well, I definitely don't want the mask. I mean, yeah, Stink you're too beautiful. Yeah, yeah. Stinkler's just too beautiful for that. Mm hmm. Uh, maybe the gauntlets, do they come with any, like, benefits? Is there pros and cons to each one? Are they all just kind of the same? For right the now, the foci, um, do not do anything for you because they must become magical first. But they do have a faster progression than the other items since they don't do anything for you at the beginning. I'm thinking the, the gauntlets then. I think that'll be kind of cool. Fine gauntlet. Trash hands. All right. I'm actually thinking about mine. Could I actually craft an instrument or something, maybe? You could. Yes. Uh, which instrument would you like? Uh, maybe a guitar? <gasps> yeah. Ooh. Oh. Oh. Okay, I always guitar. thought we'd go the uh, Vuvuzela route. What kind of guitar would you like? There's a sitar, which is like the, um, like the Jap I think that's the Japanese one. The Samshirin, which is like the Indian guitar. Or you can go with the Western version. Give me the give me the western. All right, western guitar. Would you like the? Let's see here. Uh, where is it? The Adultinian, uh, the swamp guitar, or the um, <gasps> the Dabarak guitar? So Dabarak guitar is like flamenco Spanish, and the swamp guitar is a banjo. Oh, give me the give me the flamenco. All right. All right, you got it. You've now got a guitar. Classic acoustic yeah. guitar. That is badass, dude. That's very light, too. It is. 
Does Goker know how to play guitar? Yes, he is a bard. Okay. <laughs> bard equals yes. <laughs> Dude, he's, pl he's playing Cliffs of Dover right now. If you're a bard, you're basically Prince. You play every instrument. Flamenco. All I'm proficient right. in music. As you, uh, as you gain levels, um, Goker, like basically as you progress through the story, whenever you sufficiently gain enough life energy into your into your guitar, you can actually learn specific performances that are only available for that guitar. And you can also discover uh, ballads, songs, and other things that are uh, found within Gwaeus and intricately dispersed throughout history. So there's lots, there's lots of story growth points for that and abilities you can unlock. All right. That sounds cool. Yeah. All righty. So you got your instrument. Uh, you've got your foci. Uh, Durst has a shield. You've got your mm -hmm. staff, uh, Coots, and Mori. What would you like? Uh, can Mori let the tree keep his peace? You can. Uh, so Mori is going to turn to Bright. Do we have the pieces of the tree in our hands, or does the does the? Oh, you gave them to him, and they're got offering it. to make things for you. Bright eyes, was it? Yes. I have not earned the right to wield a weapon made by this tree. I would prefer if it kept it as a memory of its kin. Bright Eyes will look up towards the treant. The treant will smile and then will place the branch onto itself. He's so cool. He's so cool. That was pretty noble. Uh, Mori is going to bow. I apologize for taking so many pieces. Bright Eyes will uh, return the bow in the trance place and then it will say well i believe that you have earned your rest and relaxation the brothels are open to you food will be prepared and lodgings have been provided you can also visit our various shop faces if you wish and in first light we shall prepare your supplies well then i am gonna head off shopping and shop around anyone like to join me i know where yeah. Alrighty, two fine dressed lads. Up I'm going to a brothel. Does anyone want to come? Oh, I'm all set on that. I was hoping, Mori, if you're not too busy, you could show me a bit on how to fly. I would be happy to. Alright, so now we're gonna do downtime stuff. Okay. Yeah. Rubs hands together. Uh so first things first, the first bit of downtime, Mori will teach Coots the intricacies of flying in Glaeus. You gain proficiency with a Glan kite, Coots. That's what you're gonna do for your four hours of uh, fuck yeah of freedom. I got you, baby. Yeah. Alrighty. Durst and Goker, you are spending your time scouring the shops, and as such, I need each of you to make me a persuasion check. Hell Ooh. yes. Oh god, do I get that with advantage with my boy? Hold on, I need to read my guy's character sheet. <laughs> Where is he? Hmm. Persuasion. Uh, you have advantage because they're your people, Goker. Oh. Roll a second time, I think. Yeah, roll a second time. Go with the higher result if it's higher. That'll work. Yeah. Oh! All right. While scouring the shops, you're able to find that there is an apothecary that is willing to sell more because Goker is one of his people. And as such, you are able to get a higher selection. Okily dokily. The party is awarded a bonus gold as well because they cleansed the monkey. So yeah. the party receives, I believe, a thousand gold pieces total. Wow. That's wow. Like pretty good. Yep. It's 62 before, right? That all, like all, all, to, all together? Uh, that's total. That's for all okay. of you. Okay. All right. So with your thousand gold pieces, you can choose which things you would like to buy for your party. Uh, so you have a list of potions that you can purchase, Ooh. which there are the regular healing potion, which is 50. Here, you know what? I'll type these up and put them in and put them in uh, the chat for you. So you guys can kind of deliberate on it a little bit because you're about to go on your first actual dungeon. So this is the prep phase. 
So make sure you spend your money wisely. Alright, so the basic potion. I guess that is part of the name. Dungeons and Dragons, yeah. Yeah, I was hoping ah. we could avoid the whole dungeon part, you know, just have a good was, life. Uh, I was, you know, man, I don't know, man. Why don't we just hang out with a bunch of sexy dragons? <laughs> so, so you're attracted to dragons? or? Listen, any powerful lady is sexy, okay? Okay. That's kind of true. Mm -hmm. This guy right here. I would love to be the man. Oh, how I would love that. Oh, my God. Okay. <laughs> All right. I'm, uh, I'm typing it up for you guys. Thank you. So you have a proper... So, Goker, do you know this guy? Like, you're talking, you're talking the lizard language. Are you friends, family? Yeah, me and this guy go way back. <laughs> How far back? Oh, I, I once got his uh, ship out of a. He was in a tight spot. I had to slay a Rengar beast. Whoa. I don't even know what that is, but damn, what a kill! Yeah. I actually ended up throwing a. I picked up a sword with my tail, threw it right through his eyes. Damn, right through both at once? Yep. Ooh, he must have been pissed. Yep, that's why I'm level 10. Hmm. <gasps> <laughs> 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 I'm doing the auditory equivalent of hole up. Hmm. <laughs> All right, and here you go. This is your selections. I put them in the group, uh, in the in the chat and Discord. Uh, in this Discord, okay. you have you have a thousand gold pieces. Your selections are: you have basic, greater, and superior healing potions, all at those prices. You have a haste potion for five hundred gold pieces, and a frost giant strength potion for seven hundred and fifty gold pieces. I trust your discretion. I'm going to uh, go to the bathroom again. I'll be right back. Oh no, too much water! Oh no, he popped the cork, it's all no, over! I, I, I ate some spicy shit today, six million Scoville in my stomach's been paying the price. Ooh, oh my no. god. Yeah, so if I'm not back, you know what happens. Stinkler, he, he had a good run of things, I'll, I'll be back in a minute. I, can't believe, I had a good run, if I don't make it, it's all I good. I can't believe Stinkler died! <laughs> on the toilet! Alright, well Elvis. guys... We have a thousand gold, and you know we should probably be pretty smart about our money here. So maybe not buy anything too expensive. Uh, what yeah, did you get, Frost Goker? Giant, Frost Giant what? potion. You wait. You bought no, one, Goker? No, 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 no. Like no I didn't that. get it yet. I'm just thinking. You know, I'm just thinking in my head. Well, 150 gold. So if we get, let's say, let's break it down this way. Okay, so a superior healing potion, six D, four plus six. Uh, yeah, yeah. Above game, uh, I think we get a. Uh, I think we want to take a couple of greater healing potions, uh, maybe one superior healer healing, and then fill up with basic. So the superior, I don't think it'll do a lot for us at this level. I think no. getting a couple basics and a couple greater. That's what I was eyeballing was a bunch of base, a uh, bunch of graders, and, a, and fill up the rest with basics. I, I would say sound crazy, but I think we should get a frost giant strength potion. <laughs> Wild! <laughs> no, 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 no! I love it. Madness. Pitch. Come on, co coats. Why does Coots want that trust strength? And then one greater healing and two basic healings. Call it a day. I, I would do. I would do a basic for everybody that's got HP under twenty, and then uh, a greater or two for myself and uh, Stinkler, who I think are over twenty now. Just in terms of resource management, I think that'll get us the best bang for our buck. Yeah. But what about the Frost Giant Strength Potion? It could be Dude, goaded. if it wasn't that much, I'd be all over that. No, 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 no. There's hold no on. reason I, I, it's that much. A potion yeah, seller? Is what, is the, what does the Frost Giant Strength Potion do exactly? We have a bit of an argument. <laughs> I'm not even there. <laughs> okay, let me... <laughs> this is all being in character. Potion seller! <laughs> oh, shit, I wasn't even doing my voice. Potion seller! What are you buying? What are you selling? <laughs> what are you selling? All right, so the Frost Giant Strength Potion, whoever drinks it, for one hour, their strength becomes 23. Oh, we gotta get that. We gotta no. get that. 
It is really good. It... That's all. No, tell you what. Tell you what. If, if we do well, we'll come back and buy it. If you oh. guys think it's a bad idea, I'll trust you. I, I I I worry about if we if we get it. So let's do some math real quick. Is that <laughs> that wipes us out? If we get that, we can get. We can get one greater healing and two basics. Yeah. And I think that's it. Yeah. So okay. if if you guys really want the frost giant potion because it's you want to like punch shit really hard, I'm totally down to let you guys do it. But we would only get, I think, three healing potions out of that. If you think we can do with that and the one that we have left, by all means, I'm not going to. That leads us with four potions. Correct. I think it's Eric it be... who can heal. I yeah. got two, I got three heals. So I, I haven't checked, selected my third spell yet, but I, have, I only have three uh, spell slots. Essentially, that's assuming so. he doesn't do any DPS, which we're going to need him to. If we no, that's why it's hold the dead. I mean, that, I got trips for that. Like, my my spells are all healing because I am the healer. But gotcha. this is in case I'm not near you. There's See an if you can haggle to get a lower price. Oh, that's a good idea. Well, well, I mean, we tried uh, um, a shopkeep, shop potion seller. Hmm. What? Well, recently we went to the. He would explain the story about taking on going to the tree and how he chopped it down, and like no, not how he chopped it down, but how they faced this. Great beast. <laughs> you know how we killed the tree a second. <laughs> how we time. faced this great beast and how we are wow. of course proceeding forward now to go help out, bring we... the corruption, add more business. And I tell you right now, if you could hook us up with a couple extra potions, I mean this, we can get this overdone quicker. We'll still pay for them. Just can you lower the price of the graders? Just, just I feel like. We, just we could do an more. ad read on our oh. next journey. <laughs> I mean, you could say the Goker was here. The Gekoi will narrow his eyes at Durst. And then in the Gekoi language, he will look to the Goker and say, The small green one thinks it can haggle me. I've already lowered the price as much as I can for you, brother. Does this thing speak for you? Hey, this guy, he's a loose cannon. I can't, I can't really speak for him. He's kind of a psycho. But maybe, you know, just, just to, just to entertain him. Literally, Durst yeah. is literally doing the same thing from anger management. The smile going, <laughs> you know, you never know when this guy's gonna lose it and get violent. And you know, I think maybe, just maybe throwing a couple free potions. You know, give us a deal here, and you know, nothing horrible is going to happen here. So, so he threatens him? Make a perception <laughs> check, or excuse me, persuasion. You got this. Come on, baby. Throwing a couple posts. Oh, hey! oh, yeah. That's what I'm talking about. The honeyed words of the Joker, or excuse me, Goker. Apologies. The honeyed words of the Goker will kind of wash over the merchant, and he'll nod. Fine. If you buy the Frost Giant's potion, I'll give you two basic ones for free. Oh. oh. We gotta go for it now. Gotta go for it now. He Ow. said he'll give us what for free? Which two? Two, two basics. basics. Two basics? That's a really good deal. That's a good deal. Let's say. Well, Goker, take us, take, seal the deal. Take us home. I'll, t I'll take the deal. All right, he'll hand you the Frost Giant potion and then two basic healing potions next to it. And you have expended 750 gold. You have 250 remaining. Man, Rhythmbot is man. dying. What is happening with Rhythmbot right now? Okay, I'm going to hit Flamenco it. music. I'm gonna, Rhythmbot was lost at sea. We've never, it's I'm, never I'm recovered. Gonna, I'm going to just. Rhythmbot really going really Rhythmbot really phoning it in today on its phone all the time. I don't know what's I found going a on. ten hour flamenco mix. I'm just imagining Goker playing it if you guys want. <laughs> nice. Excellent. You joke with like the the, the climax of the, the movie, he starts the battle with that, and everyone looks around like where is it coming from? <laughs> uh should we keep any or you guys want to just buy the last potions? Like one greater two three basic. More. What are you guys thinking? Let's survivability, baby. Just do one greater, two more basic. Might as well. One greater, two more basic. Let's load up here so we can all walk away, except for me with a basic, and we can give the two graders 
to the he to the two frontliners and the uh, the the <laughs> the frost giant strength we keep in a locked key safe away from Goker. Mm-hmm. Mm. <laughs> He's got a taste. I don't for like it. that. Oh no no hold on no hear me out. <laughs> it was great man. Thank you so much for scoring us an extra potion. All right, I'll take another two greater potions and a basic also. Well, nod. Can I get that in a pay? Can I get that in a plastic bag? Help blink. He puts it in a <laughs> basket and hands it to you. Close Thanks. enough. Hey man, that's reusable. Can I get that in a? Tips his hat as we leave. All puts right. Puts it in a bag of holding. Wait. Wait. Okay. And then that'll be an extra four hundred gold. You have successfully shopped. Are you back, Charlie? Yep. All right. As you go to the brothel, so a couple of things about the Gekoi. Uh, the Gek to Gekoi uh, to the Gekoi people. Uh, sex is not a sacred thing like it is for many different cultures. So literally, mm-hmm. a Gekoi brothel is a is a common thing. It isn't looked down on. It's just literally another business. And as of such, they are very good at it. So. As you go to the brothel, um, since you are there by, you know, by Bright Eyes Treat, they treat you very well. Your character gains inspiration after a sufficient boning. <laughs> Woo! Mm-hmm. Okay, magic so triggers go wild. Inspiration allows you to re-roll any d20 roll that you make. Like at any point in time? At any point in time. That's nutty. Why would you ever want to re-roll a d20? Or is that just re-roll the dice? Re-roll the yeah. dice. Like, a, like if okay. you roll low, you're just like, I, I thought about re-roll a 20. No, 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 not, not re-roll if he makes a 20. No, it's uh, right. re-roll the die. I mean, if you really want to, I guess you could. Yeah. I, Let's get another 20. I suppose that's, that you think could do flex. that, but, you know, just, I'm just saying. All right. Yes. So you are sufficiently boned. Nice. Is there any risk of, like, pregnancy, or did I re <laughs> this? Well, actually, uh, actually, I have rules written for that. Um, no, there isn't, because as it just right. so happens, the way that uh, Gekkoi females work is that they are resistant to that. So. Resistance to pregnancy? Uh, well, essentially how I've read it, uh, wrote, uh, wrote it, to not get into too much detail, um, the Gekkoi, when, when it's their mating season, they have an enormous, like, village-wide orgy, and the... <clears throat> insemination process goes over several different males in which each of their different uh excretions are like combative viruses that fight each other in the thunder womb and then they become pregnant when does that happen and can i come back to compete <laughs> yeah, no, i was gonna I, say I, did you say the I, thunder I, womb where we're putting i'm putting money on him right now this man is a grade a fuck okay <laughs> Uh, so, in, in other in other words uh that is not their mating it is not their uh breeding season got it so they hit the off switch so so essentially when it's not their breeding season uh, which is like one month out of the year that there is you, you can't get a get quite pregnant you, you really can't nice all right well that's good then God, so many people probably think I'm weird because I wrote rules about that. No, uh, no you are thorough, sir. Yeah, I appreciate the thoroughness. You, you, Hopefully, we can visit during the Thunder Womb. Well, trial. I based, thought, yeah, I dude. based it, I based it off of, you know, actual animals. Bro, critical. You got to get past Thunder Womb. Yeah, that's gonna be my Gordian knot. <laughs> I, have to put. <laughs> I, 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 I can't wait. I wait for Fury Road though. And that's gonna be wild. Mm. Mm. Fury Child. Okay, that's too much. <laughs> Fury Child. Oh God! Anyway, anyway, there you go, and so your uh, your four hours of freedom pass, and then the party rests in the Gekkoi village of Green Bramble. Everyone receives the benefit of a long rest, and at first light, uh, Bright Eyes summons you. Bright Eyes summons you once more into the council chambers, where you see that you have been provided each of you with a backpack. And each of you have also been provided a kite. Not a special kite, but a normal kite. We'll accept the Terran. Who doesn't need one? Uh, Let's see here. You are also given full camping supplies and three weeks of rations apiece. Oh, yeah. Three weeks apiece? Yes, sir. Wow. He's got it loading us up. A lot of weeks, yeah. Uh, 
I'm gonna Could have to make a separate thing for my supplies. Hang on a second. Yeah. Could be another snake. Let me get a document open real quick. I want to know where stuff. I uh, also we should divvy up the potions just so I know what I have personally. It's cool. I won't take any of the potions because I am the healer. So what I'm thinking is the uh, you, all you other guys take one, but the two melees take the two graders. That's it. That's the only thing I can think of for the older. Uh, so that would be Coots gets a greater, I get a greater? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I have a greater. Do I need a greater? Do I have enough health to use a greater effectively? If you use the greater, that means you have next to no health. All right. So you got, I think pretty much you would have a half heal and a full heal. Uh, you should also take the strength, the, the strength potion, because mm -hmm. Mori probably wouldn't use it, and you're the only other person that uses strength as their attack, I think. No, the mage could do it, uh, technically. Uh, yeah, I would say I would say Stinkler is kind of our our carry, so he should have it. I probably won't use strength though, because even when I run out of level ones, I'll probably resort to like infestation and cantrips like, and stuff. Yeah, one of us, the frontline fighter, should have it. It's, and I, since it was your idea, I say you'd be looking pretty badass throwing punches at twenty three strength. I'll go for it then. I'm gonna punch a dude out of his shoes. It's gonna be also awesome. it was your idea to grab it, so good on you. Uh, greater healing potion. Um... Okay, and then how many uh, miners did we get? The lesser, the normal ones. I think we have four. three. Four. No, I thought we have. We got two for free, and then did we buy two more? Yes. So we have four total, plus the fifth one that Goker had that he threw up. I thought he used that one. Uh, he threw one up in my mouth, and he threw another one up into a vial that I don't think he's used yet. But it tastes like Kool Aid. I bet it does. So we have five. So we so could Goker... all have one of those. Yes, yeah, so everybody should have one minor, and we'll have a greater apiece. Okay, okay I'll take I'll take a minor as well then. Yep. So everybody should have one minor healing potion. Or that works minor. for me. What I can never yeah. basic. It's basic. May I never use it? Um. So everybody's got a basic. We've got greater. That's one d. That's two d four plus two. This is. Got it. Rations. Uh. All right. I think I'm good. Sorry. I want that was just the housekeeping. All right. Sorry, chats. Crack me. I was like, why are you giving it to the monk? They don't use strength. Like, bro, yes, they do. Monks. Yes, use... they do use strength. Also, it was his idea. So, L L L LOL, monks with strength kill everything. All right, thank you. Yeah. I can hold it for you if you want. <laughs> <laughs> I, I swear I won't drink it. Drinks it immediately. <laughs> he, drinks it, he drinks it for a strong emotional He's like, man, halflings are dumb. <laughs> <laughs> Why don't you just? He's got a taste ten... for it now. <laughs> that he keeps was so getting... good. He keeps getting taste for stuff. <laughs> All right. Great. I like the taste. We also we still have that map. We still have that spyglass. Uh, mm -hmm. Do we have any gold left over or no? We had the sixty bucks. So we have sixty gold pieces left. Well, the money uh, I think Goker made through all through all his pocket checking. Got it. Uh, all right, water. All right, I'm good. All right. If that's the case, the party is ready, yes? Fully supplied? Mm, I think so. Either. Oh. Uh, yuppers. Finally. Let's go! You must mm -mm -mm. gather your party before venturing forth. All right, at the behest of Bright Eyes, Morning Spray, the chieftain of Green Bramble, our heroes set out from the village towards the northeast to the ruins of the Bramble Forest. All right. As I said before, this is actual dungeon time. Let's actual. fucking get it. So the use of your, uh, the use of your supplies um, will be obviously tracked. Or you'll be in a dungeon, and all of what that means. Oh, man. I am so ready. Classic dungeon crawl. Let's go. All right. Let me get all this together. I just want to make sure. I got I got one miner and one greater potion on me right now, right? Uh, you have two miners, because uh, you minors. have the one you regurgitated, and you have the one that we gave you from the five. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. I think, right? No, because we got four. Two free, and we bought two. So everybody's got one. You just have the one you regurgitated. Oh, dude. Okay. Another critical slapping video. I'll watch that later. 
critical <laughs> slap <laughs> video. Excuse me. Who'd you, who'd you slap? No, 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 no. It's a, it's the pro circuit. I, I was just enjoying the, the beautiful sport of slapping. <laughs> Competitive slapping, yeah. Chalk their hands up. Pretty uh, question: hard. You also said we had an explorer's pack. Is it? Did I hear that correct? Uh, or some some kind of pack? A full camping kit. Camping kit. Got it. What up? It's your boy, Ambience here. <laughs> Alright, don't... I thought you were about to say Ambien. Don't fuck it up this time, Rhythm Butt. Come on, baby. Hey! Okay, here we go. I hear it. Go on. Keep down. There's something hunting us. Yeah, we'll be fine. <laughs> Alright, let me know when you're loaded. Loading, loading, loading. Let the ASMR take you to the jungle. We've got fun and games. <laughs> the jungle. Welcome to the jungle. And after you have loaded, you will move into the shrine of the silver monkey. <laughs> now that's classic. Right? <laughs> this should bring back all mech. Dude, I miss Legends of the Hidden Temple, and then Guts was the other one that I loved on Nickelodeon. Yeah, mm. Guts is kind of hard. The they aggro crag, I was like, man. Hmm? I think they brought back Guts. Uh, is, they... Are these are these game shows? Yes, yeah, they yeah, were on yeah. okay. I'm sorry, as the Canadian, it's all subpart of uh oh, all subpart of uh oh. What is uh -oh. that one? Uh oh involves slime. Uh, Sinclair would love it. They actually have a thing where if you fail, your friend is covered in goo. That's good. That's, that's, that's literally Nickelodeon. double there. No, but they like, but they they started at Shifty Eyes, I think. Uh, are you sure about that? I'm pretty, yeah, pretty sure Canada's invented the concept of goo. Uh, I'm pretty sure I believe that. that. I don't know. I, that. I don't know if I trust a country that asked for its freedom in 1980. Why won't? Why won't you? Why won't you take a country seriously when our dollar is called the loony? Oh my God! By the way, I'm in. I'm I just in. in as well. yeah. uh, sorry, that was my uh, American showing. Our money is was, different I, colors. Uh, hang on. Wait. Why is it? It's loaded. It's on 83. It's like 99% loaded. Come on, man. Just wait. There it is. I was like, wait. <laughs> you guys loaded or is something wrong? Yep. Good? Oh, okay. I'm almost in. Almost there. Just waiting on the goke. I'm in. Come on, goker. You can do it. I'm very slowly putting a leaf. I'm like stuck on a leaf. Almost there. Oh man, that rain. That sounds awesome. Yeah. I really like that, that rain. That just come on. I didn't hear that yeah, when yeah, it started. It just, it just activated. Yeah. Oh, I didn't even know it had rain in it. That's awesome. I mean, that's all right. So now we're in the rainforest. Well, you basically are. All right. You're in. Everybody in? We good? Yep. 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 All right. Ah, it is intolerably moist around here. Ugh. All right, the party makes its way through the dense jungle of Glaeus until finally they come to an opening up ahead. Uh, above your HUD, it says Bramble Hollow. Sorry, Dark Souls thing. Anyway. We're in the right place. Okay, where is the bonfire? All right, when you get to this point, um, you see that there is a large rock outcropping, and there is a statue here. The statue appears to be of a woman offering a uh, offering an offering bowl to the sky. I'm going to go over by the stitch. Hmm. All right, Stinkler, as you approach the statue, uh, you can see that the offering bowl is filled with all sorts of 
gunk and discarded food and all sorts of things where once this was used as an offering bowl the temple has long since fallen out of use and now it is not but a collection of garbage this is a place of power oh beautiful i thrive here all right you may use this place of power in order to restore your spell casting abilities once okay well obviously don't want to do it now because no okay Mm-hmm. Yes, definitely save that, man. Does this restore key? Uh, no, this is something that he can do because he taps into garbage and refuse. Yeah. Right, right, this, right. This would not be useful to you, no. Stink where I got a empty Gatorade bottle if you want that. Yes, please, right <laughs> again. Thank you. Wasn't uh, besides just recharging spells? Wasn't there another thing that I could do in a, a place of power like this? Uh, yes, as time goes on, you can even enact special abilities, and you can also expend a place of power to guarantee a magical, uh, a random wild magic event. Okay, per but only in that place of power, right? But on well, you could infuse it into yourself. And then the next spell that you cast would cause it, but oh, okay. But that's a that's like a very careful move you'd have to do because you'd give up a full recharge for that. Okay, gotcha. But it is an option on the table for you. Okay, I should so I, I should point out to remind you that the wild magic table is in your favor, meaning that there is a smaller chance that something bad will be rolled. Oh, thank goodness. Good, 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 good. So I don't think there's anything that I could use this for now unless I wanted to... Well, could I do something like cover the entire forest in grease so we skate around? Not that I think that'd be overly beneficial, but... You'd have to no. roll You'd have to roll that in the Wild Magic if you want to do something like that. Okay, it's so, probably not worth it. Yeah, so essentially it's a full recharge. Right, right now it's a full recharge or a guaranteed Wild Magic event. Those are the two things you get to use it for. Okay. Um, I think I can just save it for now, then I don't... Just or... remember it's there. Yeah, and then try and maybe come back if we need it. All right. Well, for, n yep, for now, then, I, I guess we can just continue forward. Sure thing. All right. All right, remember, I the map is active, so wherever you go, that's where you go. go what does that mean? What does that mean? That basically mean means if you trigger a trap, he'll let you know. Right, okay. Yeah, basically, yep, wherever yep. you are is where you actually are. Which means if combat starts, that's where you start. Uh, can I investigate? Is there another statue? Is that what this looks like? Okay, as you start to enter the Bramble Hollow, you can see that there are these vines here looking thing. This, These are thick trunks. These act as walls. Got it. So it's a maze. Something like that. Okay. When you get to here, I... you can see a large plant that seems to be wriggling and snapping out with its vines. Yeah, um, what is this? Nature check to identify that. Any flying allowed in this area? Uh, you could certainly try. That, sure, That's I would an love to. All right, as you attempt to take off, you're able to get a little distance, but the the wall, the um, the ceiling of this room is covered by dense foliage, and there's really nowhere that you can fly to. Okay. All right, with that nature check, this is a man strangler. No. Oh, man. Oh, thank Shot. goodness. He's... Thank goodness I'm a goblin. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a halfling, so I, I'm just going to walk by here. Uh, so Gosh, you should be able to go up to that. And, uh... Essentially, this is a uh, environmental danger. If you move, if any creature moves into the area of these vines, it will attempt to restrain them and choke them to death, and then eat them. Excellent. Huh. Yeah, she should not go in there. No, I, yeah, no, I just I got a bad, bad energy from that. All right. Did get... Mori and Coots make it? Uh, they didn't step into it. At least I didn't see it. Oh, is it only on the the right side it, over here? No, it, yeah, it's only it's only on um where these roots are. Ah, uh, gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. All right, Mori and Coots move ahead, and they find themselves standing in front of what may at one point have been the temple's uh sort of entrance hall. 
you could see old, like an old statue broken and disheveled. Another offering bowl. This one, however, is empty. There is also a large hole here. Does it look like there used to be a well of some kind? It looks as if at one time it may have been, yes. Um, is there like an underground pathway that would maybe take us out of this maze and go into a cavern? Is there a way to look down there? Uh, as you look down there, you can see that there does not appear to be any cavernous expanse, just an empty well. Got it. This place has long been abandoned. Everything is in ruins. Ah, uh, you, you say abandoned, I say reclaimed by nature. The horrifying Goku, nature. make me a dexterity saving throw, please. Uh-oh. Oh, oops. I'm doing a skill throw. Boom. All right. Goker, you get to the edge of the well. The rocks begin to twist and crumple from your weight. Uh-oh. And the lip falls away. However, you roll high enough that you're able to grab onto the edge and prevent yourself from falling into the well. Would anyone like to assist him? I would oh my love God. to grab him. Everyone. Oh, there you go. <laughs> I feel like, Durst, come on! Oh, my God. No, 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 no. Don't get so close hey. to that. All right. I'm not I'm strong. Uh... Someone's strong. Help me. Uh, I'm here. I'm here. Maybe we should stick as a team, guys. I don't know why RhythmBot's broken, so if you just look in the RhythmBot channel, I'm just going to post the thing. And Got you it. You guys can just play it on your own. <laughs> I don't know why it's doing that. I'm falling in. All right, Durst grabs Goker's hand, and Coots grabs the other one, and you are able to pull Goker out and away from the edge. Ah, thank Woo! you, guys. I can't yeah, no jump problem, in now. <laughs> what? You jump in? Yep. Okay. What? Well, one second, please. <laughs> Hang Double on. Jump in the head of the air! He's gone. Coker! Can you hear us? All Just right. Can. Well, hold on. As you uh, jump down, let's see, the well is 50 feet deep. Oh. Uh, I can give you a little bit of forgiveness on the fall damage since you're going to land on soft earth. Uh -oh. Key emphasis on kind of. All right. Oh. 11 points of falling damage. Oh. All right. So let me explain how this works. You you fall into the bottom of the well, and you fall on top of a thin layer of sludge. The sludge is like rotten plant matter and water. It's nasty Goku, down here. Are you, are you okay, Goku? It's nasty down here. This sludge. Stinkler, do you still have that garbage rope? Yes, I do, in fact. We're going to have to fish him out. Well, d first, let's ask if he wants to come out. Goker, do you want to leave the hole? Yeah, it's scary down here. I think he Hold said that no. Thought. Perception checks, guys. I think it might have been a yes. A perception? Oh! Sheesh. All right, nice. Stinkler, as you are yelling down at the Goker and the Goker yells back up, Woo! you notice that your you and Mori notice that your voices seem to carry. There is the sound of shuffling coming from this direction here. Uh, excellent. Do I have dark vision? Can I see anything when I look down there extra? You can clearly see that the Goker is standing about, about shin deep in gross... Mulch water. Goker, Stinkler is going to lower a rope down to you. You need to grab it and move quickly. All right. Here she comes. All right. As you throw down the rope, the Goker climbs up it, and you pull him up as well. And as you pull him free, this time you see that the Goker's uh, legs are covered in leeches. Um, Goku, sure. don't don't look down. Well, let's, no, no, let's don't do. don't do it. All right. Uh, 
I'm looking you see. Okay, so um, does anyone can anyone do any fire? Okay. <laughs> we gotta burn these fucking leeches off. I, well, I was gonna ask, do we have any torches as part of our camping? <laughs> I have. I have news. Yes. Okay, so the leeches are going to, over time, cause damage to the goker. Oh. If you oh. remove a leech and you remove it improperly, the goker will take damage. If you remove it properly, then the goker will not take damage. Um, there are... Let me roll how many leeches there are. Oh, boy. Seven oh. leeches on the goker. All right. All right. Are we trying to remove these properly? Well, I have a, I have a suggestion. What if I used Mage Hand to reach into the leeches and peel them apart? Uh, peel them out with the Mage Hand. Would that be more delicate? That would be delicate, but a roll would still need to be made. Would I be able to brace Goker while he did that to essentially use the aid action to help him? Absolutely. <sighs> does All anyone... Right. Okay, uh, uh, um, does anyone have salt? Salt! Does anyone have salt in their pockets? Or in them? Do we have the rations? Is there, is there salt in the rations? Yeah, there's Can salt I, there. What if I made salt no. with prestidigitation out of whatever's nearby? I think you can <laughs> actually do that. Right, salt, 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 salt kills leeches! We need salt! Can you make some? Well, yes, yes, I can. Uh, do your churning, wizard, please! Of course, of course, of course. Goker, you can look down. It will terrify you, though. Yep, 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 that's a lot of leeches. Do oh. I have to cast press the, press the digitation? Well, while you're trying to figure out what to do with your friend, that shuffling comes into view. Okay. <gasps> oh, no. Maybe they like leeches. Um, Goku, don't look behind you either. All right. A harrowing wind begins to blow. <laughs> I feel like this is not the best jump, I will say. <laughs> Man, you get you needed to double jump at the last second to not take any damage, dude. Yeah, that is how it works. It's a cancel. Mm. Shit. I don't know what to do. All right. <laughs> oh, it's okay, man. I'm in a lot of those situations playing this game. Oh boy, here we go. So we got a man making salt. Well, I don't necessarily have to. In fact, I have a plan. I could grease the terrain and get them to fall in the hole. Yeah. <laughs> then I jump in there. Yeah, and then oh, go uh, through. I mean, finish them off from the top turnbuckle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you gotta do the elbow drop. Ooh yeah. <laughs> Ooh yeah, dig it. All right, I linked you the battle music. Ah. Well, all right, here we go. Yeah, here we go. Stinkler, Smelgor, you gain initiative. All right, uh, I don't have grease in the attack options here, but how exactly does that work? Could I grease the battlefield and get them to slip and slide into the hole? All right, so grease works like this. Within 60 feet of your position, you can summon a pile of grease that looks like this. It's a 10 foot square. It looks like that. Oh, hold on. Hello? Yeah. Hey. Yep. Hello. Hello. Uh, hold on, I'm getting a call from Tiffany. Hold on. All good. Ask her if she wants to go in the hole. I think she butt dialed me. Hello. Oh. I'm gonna fuck with her a little bit. <laughs> I am into this song, right? Uh, it is. 
Do you mean linked? I mean like Sorry, I had to scare her a little bit. Oh yeah. Just you just right click and hit loop. You're oh. <laughs> 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 well, I think the, I think the try yeah it's... run it back. Uh I had to scare her a little bit. Alright. We ready to slam? Yeah, yeah well, if you're ready to jam. We, we do martial checks, right? Yep, you can do it at the start of each of your turns, but yep. that's yes. what a, that's what Grease looks like there, Charlie. Okay, and I don't control where they slide. Is that determined by a dice roll? Uh, Well, they just fall prone in that area. They oh. don't actually slide unless they're at a uh, an incline. Interesting, and I assume there's no inclines here. There is not. Okay, I'm trying to think of a way to get them into this hole. I, I feel like that'd be the speed run strat. So I'll start with a martial check, though. Okay. Nice. Noise. Solid six. Mm hmm Oh, infestation. I could get lucky. How, how far do they travel on infestation? Was it 30 feet? Uh, infestation makes them go... Five feet. Oh. Which will be like this much. Ah, I see. Okay, so a bit far away for that. But if they get close, then you can maybe hit one of them. Yeah. All right. Um. Could I create an incline with mold earth and just set it up? You for could. Two turns? You could. Okay. Then uh, I'll, I think I'll probably go with that play. So I'm gonna try and set this Home Alone booby trap up. I'll go with Mold Earth. And how far does that expand? Uh, I think it's a ten foot square. Ten feet. Okay. Uh, and I, I have thirty feet to move right now. Yep. Okay. So I'm gonna go on this side of the hole, and I'll Mold Earth uh, probably about right here. Right there. This. Yeah, cover this. Is that far enough to have them slide in if they go there and I can reset? Uh, okay, for optimal use, the best shot you have of actually pulling this off is if you do it here. Because if okay. they get close and you grease this, then they could trip, fall, and then actually slide into the hole. Then, yeah, I'll cast Mold Earth there and create that incline. You got it. Goker. Uh, I'm gonna do vicious mockery. Wait, wait, the thing's not set up yet, is it? The grease trap. Not yet. Not yet. Alright, uh. I'm gonna use animal. F talk to animals. Uh, on what, what animal? On the zombies? I'm gonna try to talk to the leeches. <laughs> Yes. yes! Oh, here we go. Yes. This is here gonna we work. go. Here we go. That's, That's a great hey, idea. Okay. Can, I, can I interest you in leaving? Oh my god. Okay. Okay. You get. You cast. Talk with animals. All right. Hold on. I gotta. This is insane. This is all right. All right. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. I got this. I got this. All right. Let's do this. <clears throat> you cast. Uh, talk with animals. Yeah. What do you want? <laughs> hey. Uh. I think you guys got enough blood off of me. Uh, could you? Could nah, we you ain't got enough blood. We ain't got enough blood. We're too thin, Holmes. <laughs> what about uh, I got some. I got some other guys that you're gonna like. Oh yeah? They're Are they in my mouth right now? No. No, oh, looks like eh? you got to come up with something better than that, homie. Do you like cheese? Yeah, I like cheese. You got cheese? What kind of cheese you got? I got a four bricks of cheese coming in. Four bricks of cheese, huh? What do you think, Capo? Mm, I don't like the cheese. What else you got? Do you guys like pepperoni peppers? By any chance? <laughs> pepperoni peppers. I love that on my quiz nose. Uh, pepperoni peppers. I like peppers. Yeah. Hey, hey, you got any pizza? Oh man, I love pizza. Hell yeah, um, give me that pizza. I got a big pizza stash coming in. Pizza stash. And I just, I just tell you this, guys, because I'm your friend. Normally, I would never talk. Hey, about you ain't a fucking friend, Cabron. You are a piece of meat with blood in it. What do you boys think? That pizza sounds pretty nice. 
I don't know. It's up, it's up to you. What do you think? What do you think? You want to do what he says? You want to detach here? Mm, he looks like he's panicked. Mm, he tastes like he got some weird shit in him. How many potions do you think he drank? <laughs> like four. Come away. Cuántos no mames, güey. Pues Carlos. Fine. We let you go. But you bring us the pizzas. If you don't, next time you take a bath, wet there. The leeches detach from the go. Oh my god. How many rations? I knew that would work. The leeches detach from the goker and roll back into the well. Before yes. the last one goes, it looks back and it stares oh god, they at drop. you. They... And it goes they... inside. Durst doesn't even know what to do. He just holds his hands up. What just happened? Well, this we're going to have to get a lot of pizzas once we're done here. Goker, you might be the most special individual I've ever met. <laughs> I don't know why I made them... Uh... I was gonna say, dude. <laughs> I don't know why I made them that, but it felt right. I I can't explain it. It's like a cartel of leeches. I don't I don't want know why I made them a Mexican cartel of leeches, but I don't either, dude. It was awesome. <laughs> I thought it went really well. That, I was down it's really, with it. It's really for the comments to discuss. I think. I dos mio. I dos mio. This one's blood is oh, check on the go loco. We get those no mames, we cabron. I, I would um, I could actually imagine the leech is staying on because this dude's had a lot of health potions lately. Oh man, that shit tastes so good. Is that his whole turn, or does he also get to attack too? Because there was a lot that went on there. <laughs> my fa my favorite booyaka, part is that booyaka. my favorite one is that the people who are like fans of Iron Mouse are probably just losing their shit right now in chat. Because <laughs> <laughs> I uh, I actually learned. Um, like I studied a bunch of Spanish so that I could actually talk to her in her uh, in her character's native tongue, which is Aquin, which I made Spanish. So when I talked to her as like a Spanish demon, I actually spoke mm. Spanish to her. It's pretty good. Mm. Holy shit, dude, man! Nice. Well, I, I did that so that she would get to talk Aquin, but we'd actually be able to talk to each other and it'd seem like another language. Yeah, that's, that's really cool. That I like that. You guys hear my fan? I just turned it on. It's really hot in my room, so that doesn't bother. No, me. you're good, dude. Go nah, dude, all your fans are hot. Oh, nice. Wow. All right, Goker, you successfully uh, <laughs> nah. you successfully convinced the uh, royal blood uh, cartel to unhook themselves from your body. Yes. Yet another debt added to the ledger. <laughs> <laughs> uh, day in the life of. <laughs> uh, what else would you like to do? Uh, could I also use... I don't know if I should use Vicious Mockery. Is that going to pull the zombies too fast? Uh, you would. Uh, unfortunately, you you already used your action to cast the spell Speak with Animals. Oh, okay. So you'll have to. You have a bonus action and move. So you have Bardic Inspiration. You can move. Uh, I use Bardic Inspiration. All right. Who are you giving nice. the finger crossbows to? I'm gonna give it. What does it do? Uh, it gives <laughs> it gives them a uh, it gives them a die in this case a D6, but it does scale up later. That yeah, for, it's actually for up, very useful. For up to 10 minutes, they can use that, that D6 to add on to an attack roll or saving throw. Or another check. Well, does Stinkler have to... Does he have to, like, stay in this position right now to set up his tramp? Uh, he has to be within 60 feet of it. Yeah, so I don't have to be this close, but I was just trying to use my body as, like, a, a lure as well. Uh, maybe I should put it on Durst, and he's got low HP. I'm at max HP. I know, but your max. Is Maybe I should put it. In Can I put it on myself? I'm pretty low. Uh, you. I believe you cannot. I think you can only put it on other people. All right. I think I'll put it on. Uh, who's a good guy to put it on? I'll put it on Durst. Thank you, you very it. much. Think of crossbows. Would you like to move? I would love to move right now. So no, 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 Goker, Goker. Ah, damn. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm gonna move back here. Okay. Next we have is Mori. All right. Uh, catching what Stinkler is throwing down, I'm gonna move into position. He is this considered a square right here? Or yeah, you can stand the there. Yeah. Okay. 
Uh, I'm going to ready an attack if anybody comes within range of me, but I'm going to see if they'll use me as bait as well to go over this mound. Okay. Durst. Yes! Durst is going to step on down, see through the vines. Can I target this zombie here? Uh, the one straight in front of me? I'm going try to draw mine. What, what, that one? Yeah, that one right there. That's a wall. Damn! Okay, well, Durst is going to move a little bit more then. Hey, Taka. Yeah, what's up? It's the start of your turn. There's something you can do for free. Just saying. Special check! I, no, no, no. I, I didn't turn my button down. Is it? Yeah, it's partial check. Boom! Five. <laughs> Unfortunate. Boom! Five. Boom! Five, baby. Alrighty, so... If I get on these rocks, can I see these cop these uh, undead coming? Yeah, you can get up here. Okay, well, Durst Five gets up to see elevation. the... Alrighty, because then Durst is going to target the one in the middle here uh, with Toll the Dead. Yeah. Toll the Dead! Oh, 12 mm -hmm. wisdom save. No! Takes eight points of damage. No! Oh, it hurt. Did it already take damage? It took I, two. I so. made save! Oh, shit! Yep. Oh, no! That zombie's dynamite! <laughs> dynamite. Coots. Yo! Okay. Um, I have a plan. I want to... How far can my uh, dart go again? Uh, 30 feet. Okay. So can I walk... Can I walk where Mori is? Or am I not allowed to be on Mori? You can't end your movement there, but you can walk through his space. Okay. Oh, I see. Okay, wait, wait. Oh, God. Oh, here, God. Hold, hold, here, hold, hold. Sorry. I, hold, I put my, here, I hit hold my on, hold on. Don't, don't panic. Don't panic. I got you. There you go. Hey. Okay. Can I shoot my dart from here and then back up? Yes, you can. All right, there I'm going to dart up. Uh, let me hit my quick marshal check, though. Good man. How's that? 11. All right. Kind of powerful in a way. An 11 will reveal to you that these creatures are mindless. They will attack the closest enemy. Okay, perfect. Then I would like to dart uh, coughing dead seven. You got it. Take the throw. Gee. Oh, righty. Coughing dead seven. That unfortunately will bounce off its undead hide. Tink. Oh. Okay. All right. <laughs> then I'm just gonna back up here. And am I allowed to moon the enemy to entice him to walk into the strap? Showing him your ass will have little effect, for it is dead, and no okay. longer cares about the eating of ass. True. Coots does it anyway, hoping it has some effect. <laughs> <laughs> Man, this excellent. This is how Coots dance when Come he's not wearing bit. underpants. Oh, here we go. <coughs> how dare. Hey, it worked. They're falling for the trap. All right, they will stand on an incline awkwardly. That's their movement. This one will attack Mori. Uh, okay. Oh. <laughs> Critical hit. Oh, awesome. And it will deal nine points of damage. Ow. Well, I just got crit. In addition uh, to that... Does my attack go off when he gets in range? Did you ready? Yes. Uh, yes, it does then. Okay. Uh, do I hit with any bonuses for them being on the incline or not yet? Because they're standing still. Negatory. Copy that. Regular uh, swing. Cord. Uh, it's a 14 to hit. That will miss. Son of a bitch. Oh, God. All righty. Okay. A couple of things oh. to keep in mind. Their hungering claws ability has now been uh, revealed. Each time one of these, these undead creatures successfully hits you, they receive a plus one to attack and damage. Okay. 
Hmm. I will mark the ones that have empowerment. And they didn't fall in the grease trap or what? The grease trap is not active yet. yet. Okay. It's a two-turn trap I have to lay. Got it. Well, I'll keep them here. I think. Yeah, you just need to hang tight. Okay. Stinkler Smelgor. Okay, I'm absolutely using uh, grease now. And I will grease the incline. Uh, incline. Oh, the incline? Right. All right, here we go. Let's grease go, it baby. up, baby. I'm drawing that for you right now. Grease. Let's see if fortune's on your side. Come on, baby. DC on. is 11. Fail. Pass. Fail. Yeah. Fail. Yeah! Yeah! yeah. Alright, so it seems that Seven was the one to make it. These two fail, and they fall prone. But because they are on an incline, they will fall prone into the well. Those fools <laughs> fell right for the old Stinkler trap. Uh, how are you nice. going to be so dumb falling, dude? Like a dumbass. 16 I would points fall of falling trap, damage. Wow. Are they still alive? Can they, like, climb out? All right. Uh, they will just fall in the hole. They cannot climb, so they are effectively defeated because they can't get out of the hole. Nice. Uh, Boys. Goker, you will hear echoing... Far down inside of the well. Hey, Cabron, this is not a pizza! <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Chingue, Cabron. This one falls down. And then it's double I'll soft, baby. Remove these from the fight. Okay. Well done, Stinkler. Your trap laid. Uh, however, Grease is a first level spell, and that means... Wow, magic. Yes, sir. Not this time. Fuck. All right, what? what would you like to do next? Um, I'll move back just a little bit since we don't all need to crowd it now. Okay. I'm all good. Okay, 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 okay. I'm okaying. I'm slamming. I'm jamming. I'm feeling it, Mr. Krabs. I'm really feeling it. Goker. Alright. I'm gonna do the martial check again. Not this Is that time. Any good? Oh, crap. All right. Uh, I'm going to do Vicious Mockery on <laughs> the, the dude in the Coughing Dead 7. That one? All right. I'm gonna bust out the guitar here. Oh, I was, uh, you! I was hearing. I was. I was listening for. <laughs> this. This is part of the. This is part of the insult. All right. Uh, I haven't seen uh, coughing dead uh, this bad since I was watching uh, The Walking Dead. <laughs> that was the good turn. Nice. Nice. The creature is confused. It's not walking right now. <laughs> That's literally half the name. Excellent. Hmm. <laughs> Mori. Uh, I would like to five foot step over here uh, and attack the guy who's prone. You have advantage because he's I prone. I sure do. Punish the Let's weak. Go. Kill him. Kill him dead. Hey. Roll again. Hey. Yeah. Let's uh, hit it one more time. Finish it. Hey. Hey, oh, better. Right, well, yeah. I'll hit the other one because it's higher damage. No, you take the highest one. Up. Damn it! Five damage. All right. Right. 
Why did you hit me, Billy? Durst. Because you a bitch. You are a bitch. <laughs> you are a little bitch, Billy. Bitch boy. Durst going big. Yeah. Is it my turn? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, hell yeah. I, sorry, I didn't hear you. I think uh, you were cutting out on my end of arcade. The internet's been fucky all day, though, so. Uh, Durst is gonna. <laughs> Durst is gonna try and move over. <laughs> And, like, l try and lure... You know that zombie who was just hit? The one who's standing right there by the edge? Yeah. Durst is going to yell... Just yell at the top of his lungs. And hit him with a thaumaturgy. As a matter of fact, goes... He's going to hit him with a thaumaturgy and said, This way! <laughs> All right. You scream at the zombie with thaumaturgy. Wait, hold on. Did it, did it do anything, Durst? Hold on, hold on. About to find out. <laughs> How loud is Thomas? It's yelling like, ah! Okay. One moment, please. Oh, oh no. Oh. I got a feeling it's going to backfire on us. What in the world? I might have fucked up, guys. What did you just do? I might have fucked up. Uh-oh. Huh. You may have triggered some kind of avalanche. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Go ahead, Coots. All right. Uh, Coots would like to run over here. Great. Um... And what? Hit him, you got oh, advantage. Yeah, I'm, I'm thinking Beat his ass. if I want to use any key, I'm going to hold off. I'm going to keep my key and just go for a uh, short sword attack. All right, I'll roll again because it's uh, prone. In case you crit. Okay, first one will hit for nine. Good work. You may also... And then I can make an unarmed strike, right? Yes, sir. Bonus action. Also rolled at advantage. All right. Crit. Easy. Ooh. Almost. One more time. All right. Six damage it is. Whoo, lad. That's a lot of damage. Since he's on his uh, ass. Can I walk away without having a, one of those walk away checks? Uh, well... He will still get an attack of opportunity, but he will make so it, he will make it at disadvantage. I would love to just just hide a little bit behind Mori here. Accurate. Just All right, right here. All right. Attack it with disadvantage. Miss. Nice. Good work. Gouged. <laughs> All right. Dexterity saving throw for this one. Make. This one will attack Mori. And we'll miss. Woohoo! This one will attack Durst. And we'll hit Durst for five damage. Damn. Uh, shoot. Okay. Okay. That one is now empowered. Okay. Stinkler. Infestation on these guys, does it, it won't do the poison damage because they're undead, but will it make them move? If they fail it, yeah. Okay. Um... You guys will finish off coughing dead six. The other one's full health. I'm going to try and get it to fall into the hole. I'll cast infestation and see if I can get lucky and make it fall. All right, constitution. It will fail. First step down. Sorry about the yawning. I've been doing oh, this a all while. Good. It's a long day. <coughs> Let's see here. 1d4. 
So we're looking for a one or a four here. Let's go. Ah, oh. bitch. Bear. Bear. Down he goes. Well, I it was a good shot. I'll, I'll just stay here. Uh, I think that's good. Directions built into the macro. Where? It already. Oh, it's right there. It's right there. Oh, okay. Okay, never mind. My bad then. Four. Boom, boom, boom. Give it another deck save. See if it's. Oh, that's not enough. Yeah, yeah baby. Goes. Aki, not the pizza. Porky! <laughs> yes. Thank you. Well, you saved my life. Anytime, Durst. Don't say that. I'll take you up on it every day. That's all my turn, then, baby. I'm good. Goker. Uh, all right, I'm thinking we, we want to end this with style. Now, would it be possible for me to pick Stinkler up and throw him at the Coughing Dead Six? Possible? If you were strong enough to do that. Dang. Looks at Goker's strength. You are not strong enough to do that from this position. Okay. Well, maybe I could I pick Coots up, perhaps, and throw him at the coughing dead. If you rolled well on an athletics check, I suppose you could. All right, I'm doing it. That's not good. Oh, no. All right. You grab Coots, <laughs> and you pick him up to throw him and miss. <laughs> oh, come on. <laughs> Coots, make me a dexterity saving throw to grab the edge of the well. <laughs> oh my god! I must remind you there are three undead in there. Yes, yeah, the whole dead. Why though? What? We were doing so well! Oh no. Can I reach to grab his hand, please? Because I'm right by the edge of the. <laughs> yeah, does anybody get a dex save? Uh, I, I, I can reroll it too. I can reroll it too, right? Yes, because you're Gamber born. All right, all right. Oh, all right. you lucky dog. Come on. Okay. Please. All right, all right. Oh, please. I'm sorry. No! Ah! No! Bunker, uh -oh. why? Say hi to those guys down there. Oh, my no! God. <laughs> uh, okay, go, go crowd. Ah! Ah! Now, I had a question. How much damage did those z zombos take when they slapped into the ground after 50 feet? Oh, 16. <laughs> All right. Uh. Okay, Coots. What's up? <laughs> Why did you take you 19 have... points of falling damage. Oh, no! I don't have that HP to give. No, the maximum. He's already he's dead instantly. That's not good. <laughs> uh -oh. Perhaps when I fell, the potion in my pocket shattered, causing uh. it to go into effect. Okay, so... Oh, God. What is the distance of Cure Wounds? So, I guys, the best enemy that Arcadum could come up with is just the party. <laughs> okay, no, legit, legit here, though. If you get me down on that oh. rope, I can Cure Wounds him out. Okay, so... A couple of things. Hi. Yeah, oh, hi. We're in the hole. Uh... For elevation and tracking purposes, this is what being in the hole looks like. Okay. So, this is what happens. Goker, I need you to make me a persuasion check. All right. This is for the leeches. Oh, please. That is not sufficient. Oh, come on. Hey, cabron, now that's a pizza. Oh, that's fuck. not a pizza. Oh, that's my God. Pizza. I've got a, I've got bad news. Coots. 
And also, somewhat good news. The good news is, is that these creatures do not have Ruthless. So they will not attack you while you are downed. Oh, oh thank my God. God. However, oh God. you are unconscious, face down, in sludge water with leeches eating you. The party has, Is that like a problem? It is. The party okay. has three rounds to save Coots as he will automatically fail his death saving throws. Oh, if it gets to the third one, he dies. All right. Oh, a, well, he I doesn't have, get uh, saved. It's uh, just every round he counts as a failure. That I have a plan. He does, normally he would roll. He does not get to roll because leeches are draining him. Got it. Okay. Goker. Go, don't. You unfortunately have failed to throw your halfling friend at uh, the undead. Would you like to take any other actions? You have a bonus in the rest of your move if you'd like. Does anybody else want to get thrown for the attack? No! <sighs> Could I go over here and hit this guy with a dagger? <laughs> with your bonus action, yes. All right. That's a one. Also, a huge and not one. All right, now make me a dexterity saving throw because you walked into the grease, Goker. Oh my! Uh, god. Oh my uh, god! Uh -huh. Oh no! That succeeded. So you do not fall into the hole too. Uh, that would have I'm been. Afraid of grease? Come on now. <laughs> <laughs> Man. <laughs> Just imagine Murray. the Coots literally the family guy flop position. God, down. why? Okay. It was all I going this... so well, too. It was! All right, I need this to be over. I am going to burn Fighting Spirit, so I will have advantage on this attack, and I will get plus five temporary hit points. Okay. Um, and then I will swing at the guy in front of me. Uh, 17 or 18. 18 for 8 damage. He is yep. make fucking mega dead. Good. As he dies, uh, you will watch Mori cut the head off of this zombie, glare at you very angrily, and then it is a bonus action to administer a potion, correct? Negative. It is an action. Shit. Yeah. Um, is it a bonus action to throw one down at him? Uh, it is, but he it won't heal him. It won't heal him. Mm -hmm. um, I, I have a plan cooked up. We can save him. Yeah, well, we got. We, I, I believe in our creativity. We could. We we have, we have the passion. <sighs> um. All right, Sorry. that'll be that'll Sorry. be turn. <laughs> oh, oh, I don't. I don't. I don't. Oh, I, this uh, went poorly. Why? It was fine. We killed three of them. Maybe we can fill it up with water. I. He'll float up. He'll float up. <laughs> Have you heard of drowning? <laughs> That's a strategy Mac and Charlie had, and it's always sunny in Philadelphia. All right, Durst, your turn. Durst. All right, now, for my action, what is the what is the range on Healing Word, actually? I'm curious. You said there's a 50. It. I'm pretty 50, sure it's 60. It's 50 feet. Is so, it? So... Yeah, you said this this pa this hole is fifty feet, right? It is. Uh, the range is sixty feet, so you can just heal him with healing. Words. I can, but there are zombies down there. That's true. Yeah, so don't do it yet. I'm thinking I'll mold Earth on my turn to lift him up, and then you could heal him above the zombies because he said they can't climb. So it should be if fun. you okay, uh, oh, I can't meta game, but okay. Uh, if you want to do that, you want to go to the strategy? Want to do that? Try to give this a shot. Kind of what I was thinking. I mean, that's yeah. not meta game. He's talking to you about. It. That's fine. Yeah. No, fair, fair enough. Fair enough. All right, so sounds good. All right, let's try and do the, the one, two. All right, so yeah. you're ready. You want to ready that action? Yep. Uh, so I'll get near the hole. It's no, I'm talking to Durst. Do you want to ready that yeah, action? Yeah, I'm, I'm, ready, I'm, ready, I'm, ready, I'm going to ready that action, All yes. Right. Coots, one fail. Coughing dead, can't climb. Stinkler. Okay. Uh, mold earth under Coots, lifting him towards us. All right, you're able to lift up Coots uh, out of the sludge. Slightly above the uh, the Zambos. I hit him with a healing word. Healing word goes off. Go ahead, roll healing word for me. Absolutely, dude. Come on, baby. Six. Hey, Coots, you're healed for six. Yes. Let's go. Welcome Boom. back, baby. Yeah. Thank you. 
Oh God, what happened? I just remember uh, Goker we picking me up and throwing me. There was a zombie that came and pushed you from behind, but I took care of it. Goku. Oh, thanks, guys. <laughs> it's your turn. All right, I'm gonna uh, 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 I'm gonna, I'm gonna do, I'm gonna jump onto the platform with Coots. Is that possible? That is. All right, I'm jumping on there with him. All right, you slide down the wall. You have a climb speed, so that's easy enough. Could I pick him up and get him out of there, perhaps? Yep, and you have yeah. the climb speed for that. All right, I'm bringing him out. All right, Coots is grabbed by the Goker, and the Goker kind of up the side of the wall. And now that the party is safe... Oh. I always feel confident and comfortable in your hands, Goker. Oh, shit. This battle has come to its conclusion. We did it. You've never done me wrong before, Goker. Thank you for saving me. <sighs> no problem, kid. Hero. All right. I'm a hero. Take a moment to decide how you will recover from this fight while I go to the bathroom. I would recommend a short rest so he can roll some hit die. Sure. <laughs> hey, Sinkler. Sinkler. Good teamwork there. You moved That's... him into range. It was easy. I'm not gonna lie, you're you're an unconventional wizard, but you you make a you do you do good work. Oh, thank you. It's all the garbage. I simply use it to the best of my ability. Well, you do know, I they... still have leeches on myself. You sure do. <laughs> oh, <laughs> Goker, talk to them. Yeah, we're go gonna, go we're, go gonna to we're gonna deal with that when he gets back. I <laughs> <laughs> Great. Honestly, I was expecting a fight to break out with the maggots inside the zombies. Oh, and we those... were doing so well, too. Like, that was a really good plan, uh, Critical. I thought when you yelled that it was going about, about to bring out, like, 8,000 more people. That's yeah, what we... I was worried about. What did it do? We uh, don't know. He we just don't rolled. know. I, we, just... It could have done that. We don't know. They might he, be on their way. He kept rolling. I do not forget. For what it's worth, we do have those little things that keep out the undead out of houses. So if we can find a place where we can place that seal, they can't get in technically. So if we're surrounded, we have a kind of a fallback plan, so to speak. But we need to have a threshold so they can't cross. Yeah, makes sense. I'm going to fill up a water real quick while he's doing that. Yeah, yeah I'm going to go some water too. Short, short, re short rest makes the most sense because the hit die will save the potions. Yes. Be right back. Awesome. I'll, uh, I will hang out here with everybody. Hi, guys. What up, Arcadum's chat? I see you now. Yeah, I always stay with you guys. It's a lot of highs. <laughs> Hi, Batman. <laughs> no, we are not doing the Bosco halftime show on Arcadum Street. That's a Wednesday thing, guys. Oh, God. This is like an episode of Under the Red Hood. It's bonk. Donkey, are you still here? Yeah. Oh, hi. I'm trying to explain uh, the origins of Goku. The <laughs> He was Somebody born in a asked. vat of chaotic evil. <laughs> well, they were asking about the inspiration. They said if he was inspired by Joker, but that wasn't actually right. What was the inspiration? Well, I looked up, I was reading a lot of old mythology, different cultures. Mm -hmm. And it's very sophisticated and very, it's very advanced and nobody would actually understand. Oh, got it. So basically, you you looked up old ancient cultures and and picked and chose yeah. from all those. Nice. And I pretty much read like all the old ancient texts from around the world. Dude, how did you get your hands on those? Oh, that's in the museum. I did have some hints of the story of Gilgamesh in the character of Goker. Yep, yep. Gilgamesh definitely drew on some influences from that. Nice. Very nice. And none at all from Batman, I imagine. 
No, I have I have never seen this. He's never even heard of Batman. You've apparently. never seen you've never heard of Batman. Yeah, I don't even know. Pretty it's, I don't even know what that is. Yeah, yeah it, it's honestly, the... it's not one of Marvel's better characters. I f- I feel differently than you guys personally, but I can see that perspective. Do you think Batman's one of Marvel's better characters? I would say it is not a Marvel character. Got him. Dad, how could you? Got him. Why would Came you lie to just for that? Like that? Next, you're going to tell me Iron Man's not DC. That's messed up. No, the uh, character went to Washington, DC in the second movie. I know. That's what I'm saying. He's DC mm-hmm. all the way. God bless you, Ed. God bless you. Can we kill you? And what games can we kill you in again, by the way? Uh, Doom. Good. Uh, good. <laughs> good. Twice. <laughs> Go ahead, I can kill you twice. You can kill me twice. You can kill me Excellent. as a marauder, and then you kill the icon of sins. It's, it's double, double, double your Bosco death. D- du- double the dip? Yeah, double the dip. <laughs> I'm also the biggest pain in the ass in that game. Oh, oh yeah, there's that one. There, I remember I, I was bitching to you in Discord. The initial uh, fight where he comes through the portal? Yeah. It's, no, that, that fight was easy. That fight was baby bitch easy. It, it goes to you first round. Um, But uh, oh, the, the, okay. later, the optional fight later on was difficult. That one, uh, the, there's that one part- two, no, that's the expansion where you fight two of them. No, there's there's one in particular in a very small room where you fight him. That, that's a problem. He can close in coup quickly. What up, Arcadum? I'm back. Hey, hey, hey. What's the plan? Short rest? Uh, so I we were thinking short, short rest. I'm uh, curious. What is that wooden thing you see over? We see the statue, but there's a wooden kind of like almost like half a, what do you call it? A bodega or a. You mean this? Yeah, yeah. That right there, yeah. Uh, that is a yokai shrine. Where are you guys seeing this? This right uh, here. To the, I think it's upper left. Oh, you mean this right here? Yeah. yeah. Was... Yep. That's a minor shrine. A minor shrine. Okay. Okay. So FYI, <laughs> you just got the leeches on coots. Yeah. 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 Off. Would so you I, like uh, to bargain with them again, Goker? I know these guys. You know, right, okay. I know these guys. Well, well, me. well. Look at that, compadres. It's the fucking gecko back again, huh? What, you got a problem with us feasting on the pizza you dropped for us, Holmes? Fellas, fellas. You gotta, what you gotta understand is this is not a pizza. This is called a halfling. This is much the leeches look at each other. Um. Hey, my my name's my name's Coots. Can they can they understand me? Can they understand me, Goker? This, I don't... this thing keeps making weird yakky sounds. We don't like it. Basically, what he's trying to say is that he's not pizza. I come in peace. So he's about to come in pizzas. <laughs> the leeches are driving him mad. He's making no sense. Coots, you're pissing him off, Coots. <laughs> Shut the fuck up, bro. I'm trying to work. <laughs> what do you mean? I, I was trying to be. Gosh, let me just let me just over I here. feel like God, I can dude. I feel like I can sway them. All right, what do you want to say to them? Get off of me and and we'll be cool. All right, all right, let me translate that. All right. Leech is basically what he's saying is if you get off of him, you'll be cool. And he's got pizza, he's got a connection. His uncle works at a pizza place. Cabron, one time we already did this for you, huh? You say we give pizza. Then you say he not pizza. Then you throw a bunch of dead fuckers on top of us. You know what I say to you, Cabron? Maybe we drain this affling eye, huh? We just drain his ass dry, and then what are you going to do about it, huh? I'll just did throw him back in that well. I don't care. D- d- is it going good? Yeah, we got him on. We got him right on the ropes. Awesome. <laughs> Editor's note. It, it wasn't. It was go <laughs> doing a pain <laughs> thumbs up. That's great. It's my only hope. Yeah, you go ahead and dry him dry. I don't give a shit. <laughs> oh, <laughs> but if you want pizza, then you're gonna have to let him go. The leeches will look at each other. We're talking deep dish. They look I'm at each other with buggy. wider eyes. We're talking pepperoni and onions. 
Oh, Whoa. oh, oh, oh. Don't Cabron. Don't tell him about that deep dish. That's Chicago, man. Yeah, 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 yeah. I get it. I get it. Hey. All right, loser, man. You listen to her. Eh? You listen up, eh? You All go. Right. You get the deep dish. You bring it here. You bring it here right now. You get that right deep now? dish. You get that deep dish. You bring it here. Me, my my compadres, we eat pizza. We let little halfling go. That's how this goes down now. All right, but I'm gonna need you to get off of him first. Then we'll go get the pizza. Then we'll come back. And we'll leave him here as collateral. <laughs> All right, the leeches will detach themselves and surround Coots. Deep dish saves the day! <laughs> ah, it's really strange that they've done that. Oh, well, good. Just try stop it on him. <laughs> 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 that problem is solved. Moving on. I need the brawn! Better go to the of All right, you step on the leeches. <laughs> All righty, problem solved. Uh, once, once Joker is done getting the leeches off of uh, uh, Coots, Maury is going to approach him. You are going to get a death glare from Maury. Uh oh. Deep down inside of the hole, you hear. Ave Maria. <laughs> Goker, I need you to listen to me very carefully. All right. You have stolen. You have tricked and you have lied. And I have looked the other way. But what you will not do again is put one of us in danger. We are a team. Is that understood? Yep. Good. Swear to me. <laughs> Swear to me. <laughs> Maury, I think you got it wrong. Goker's the one that saved me. Anyway, where are we going on. next, guys? <laughs> that is true. I saved him. Good. And you broke even for the day. That is a good question, though. Where are we going next? There seems to be a path to the left. Hey, guys, we broke even, right? Yeah? You, you save him? Yeah. Yeah. All right. I'm telling you right now. We can go over to by that shrine. Maybe we should rest up a little bit. We all took some nicks from that. Yeah, I'm fine with that plan. I want to take a nap. Uh, yeah, I'm down with a short rest. All right, the party goes to short rest. Uh, oh. and then as the animal speech fades, the Goker over here is in the hole. I knew these boys. <laughs> I knew each of them. So they the were Italian amongst now. us. They were good boys. Know this, Maria. That I will find who did this. I will find them. I will punish them. I will drain them dry. And it will be a sanguine festival. Oh, it's never good when they say sanguine. Oh my sanguine god. Sanguine festival. Oh boy. I think we made a powerful enemy today. <laughs> dude, those are like, I've, I've seen sanguines, dude. They're like dude, penguins. Dude, this was a completely like different... Bigger. It cut away from us to a whole really well-shot scene. Dude, he... Arcadum had one destination involved, but now the last boss is just going to be an army of leeches. <laughs> Episode 10, we're just going to be slicing through leeches. I do leeches. wonder how much he's had to throw out because Bobby, of so far. Listen to me. We will find this Goku. We will bring him to me. We will put him on his knees. He will beg for forgiveness from Licha Maria, and he will not get it. <laughs> and then, as an Ave will play for him, we will put him in the soil. Go and find him. Bring him to me. I'm sorry. One of you guys, like, throw, like, a... Like, burn that whole well <laughs> in there. <laughs> <laughs> Can one of you cast Fireball? <laughs> No, no, this is where you ask Stinkler to cover it up. And problem solved. Yeah, Moving on. We are to Maria. Oh, rock on it. Problem you solved. No, I am a righteous on. man. Technically, yeah. Durst killed them all. Oh, oh shit, that was that me. That's all right. I'm, I, I'm willing to risk Goker's life over you stomping them. <laughs> it's uh, a risk we're so willing to take. So brave yeah. of you. Some of you may die. 
But that's a <laughs> risk. But that is a risk I, I am willing, willing to take. take. <laughs> it's, with lift go. That is a sacrifice I am willing to make. I've right. right. made many sacrifices in my life. Well, anyway, uh, at the end there. Can we roll hit die to, uh, sure. to, to yeah, heal up for ahead. those of us that are hurt? Sweet. What's it called? Uh, you roll hit. I think it's one of the buttons that we have. Yeah. Right? Would it be healing? Uh, it's just your your level hit die. So for Got Durst, it. it's a D eight. For Coots, it's a D eight. For Joker, it's a D eight. For uh, the Samurai, it's a D ten. And for Stinkler, it's a D six. Easy enough. In, in brackets. In brackets. D eight in bracket. In brackets. Yeah. I'm back up to max, baby. Hey, uh, do you you add your con to this? I believe or no? Yeah. Yeah. Yep. So it's your your D eight plus your con. Plus my con. Yeah, your uh, your constitution. Your constitution modifier. is a plus two, so coots you would get four total. Hey, you back? Nice. All right, you can choose to spend another one if you wish, coots. Another another hit die. You have two. Yeah. All right, go ahead. Get them all back after your next full rest. Oh, that's a big roll. Hey, there's an eight. Hold on, plus two is ten. You're back to full, window. baby. Huh, I'm gonna go check this out. Good uh, stuff, Coots. Finally. Noise, noise. Here we go. I forgot about the rerolls. That's convenient to reroll. I know, right? Mm. Well, I, you get to I, do I it on want... ones and twos, which is nuts. Yeah. And you do you crit on nineteens and twenties? I don't know about that. Okay, I didn't know if it went both ways. Uh, Requies got in pace, Fettuccine Alfredo. Yeah, I do feel like the final boss will be a bunch of Italian leeches. <laughs> I don't understand why you're here. I heard a joke from an Italian the other day. Can I say it? Uh, sure. as an Italian, I will allow this. How did the How did God get revenge on the Romans? How he turned them into Italians? Dang. <laughs> yeah. No, that's fair. So, what are you guys getting up to this week? I'm back. Oh, he's back. Never mind. Sorry. All right, we're all healed up. All right. Uh, Cooch rolled a D8 and he got eight, which is nice. Eight plus two is that's plenty. Yep. Goker, did you roll any? Uh, Goker got a six and a, and I think that's it. Six. So we got. Can eight. I roll again? Hold on, you got eight, which puts you at three hit points down. Can you can, make another roll? Yeah, you can. Yeah. Boom. Boom. That's there. It is. The one you needed. All right, we're back to full health. Hell yeah! Full health nice. from a short rest. Hell yeah! Oh yeah! Oh, I forgot you have Song of Rest actually, Goker. You add ten to everyone, so everybody, everybody gets back a uh, a hit dice. Oh hell yeah! Oh, okay. Sweet. Hell yeah! Nice. Excellent. All right. Uh, so above game, I was looking at the map. If we want to continue the. Uh, directly to the south over uh, where is it over here uh this path will take us towards the water i don't see any other potential outlet there's no really other openings i'm good to go in that direction i'm fine with wherever really yeah, yeah let's keep it. it up it would lead us over here so um i'm cool with going first though i don't mind getting hit uh excellente want to follow behind again yeah Lead the way. I can't wait to trigger a trap that I don't know about. Hot Wheels oh, leading oh. the way. Hot Wheels definitely leading the way. All Where right. Do I go? Oh. Oh. Uh, all right. Before all right. I step in the water, though. When you get to about here, you can see that yep. there is cool, clean, and clear water kind of flowing throughout this part of the area. 
Okay. Disgusting. Uh, oh. Is it? <laughs> is, it uh, <laughs> is it like calf high? Is it ankle high? Is it knee high? Uh, it is shin high. Got it. Um, shin Godzilla high? How sh- how high is shin high for coots? Waist. There you go. Hmm. Uh, I will test the water by stepping into it to see if anything bad happens. It is cold. All right. We should be able to traverse, to traverse this fairly easily. Stakler! Yes, are dearest. You, are you going to get in the water? Yep. <laughs> is, I got is this the reverse sh- equivalent sh- of when you put a little bit of dial soap for that ad. The complete reverse <laughs> happens in my head. <laughs> I don't get All clean. Right. I just make the water oh, a little hold dirty. Hold up, hold up, Durst hold takes up. off his yep. jacket and puts it over his head. Oh, God. When, you, tiny. when you get to about here, make me a perception check. Excelente. All of us? Yep. Okay. Jeez. Why won't you do that? There we go. There it is. All right. When 16. you get to there, you can hear shuffling coming towards uh, you from which direction all right you hear it coming from this direction excellent i believe Is we there... have more company should we follow that or walk away from it my guess is they're probably guarding the way out well let's keep going in we should be careful there's another one of those trees that you pointed out up ahead I'm gonna keep my head above water here. <clears throat> I would recommend if we're going to avoid them, we stick to the left path away from the tree. You know this land way better than us, so you take it away. All right. All right. Hold on. As you get to about here, mm-hmm. the party's crossing. These creatures appear on the corner. Uh oh. Oh, those are, are ugly. Good. That's terrifying. Yeah. There's oh, three good. Of them. Where's the third one? They got a lot of health. He's in your yeah, house where, right now. Where is the third one? Did he not? Oh, I didn't have him selected when I revealed him. He's, he's right now waiting for his Starbucks coffee. <gasps> oh, good. Sorry, I'm late. All right. <laughs> These three creatures appear at the northern end. You can see that they move forward with uh, faces kind of trapped in an eternal scream that makes no noise. To the east, however, more shuffling can be heard. And you see these creatures have wandered up. Uh, or, not, excuse me, west, I mean. And you see these creatures appear. Oh, Jesus Christ. All right. Our heroes prepare themselves for another battle. Weapons drawn. And the harrowing wind begins to blow. Next time on Lost at Sea. Oh, we're going to start with the fight. I I knew. Yeah, perfect cliffhanger. I was was coming up with schemes. I know. I was like, how do I do this? The screaming horror is a... Out of game question, when I see like a chest here, can I do I see that even though I can't see that from where Coots would be? Well, uh, let's go and talk about that. Um, the reason I don't use vision blocking is it lags out the map really bad. But these are walls and things like that. So unless I call a perception check for you to see that, or you, so like you can't see where things are on the map and like walk towards them because your character doesn't right. know about that. The reason I don't yeah. use vision blocking for the players is that it's really laggy. So. Yeah, I just want to make sure I didn't like miss anything. Gotcha. No, 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 you're fine. You're fine. You're fine. All right. But to oh, answer your question, for things like chests and stuff, if you if your character can see it line of sight wise, because where you're standing right now, you can't see that because there's a wall here. But if you're like standing there, you're like, wait, there's a chest there. You can see that because I didn't hide it. I did not hide it on the map. So I see. So you're good. You're good on so that. So line of sight counts as what we can actually see. That is correct. In character. Got it. Yeah. Alrighty. And there we go. Heck yeah. Let's see about that fan art. 
Yeah. Let's go. Let's ah, do I gotta the get fan art. I, I got to get to your stream real quick. I'll be right there. <laughs> All righty. Clap, 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 clap. This is a nice long session, too. Yeah, this was a lot of fun. Thank you for, for running. No problem. Mm -hmm. Yeah, wonderful as always. Yeah. This is, uh, this is what I do. Whew, man. One second. Okay, getting that set up. Boom. We got a Stinkler Smile Gore. Oh, no, we're hey, Stinkler! Starting strong. That looks like that one. Oh, what's that one anime? No idea. Also, how did you like the Promised Neverland? Huh? How'd that go I for you, I've not caught up yet. Have you, did you finish it? Oh my god. Oh wow. That's amazing. Promise. I love the pinky. Yeah, yeah, pinky up. Ludwig, it is the worst ending to anything I've ever seen in my Pro life. Promise Le Netherland is a great anime till you get to the end. Yeah. yeah. Uh, I am cut deep by what you guys are saying, but I th I'll th I'll give it, it with an open mind. Ooh, oh shit. Nice. Oh yeah. Badass. My unarmed strikes. Or, or is that Goker throwing me off a ledge? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. We'll find out next time. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> And then there was Durst being Ooh, awesome. And then there was the Durst. Oh. Durst is cute. Mm -hmm. That's a that's a skinny Durst. That's summer bod. That's de that's definitely his favorite summer camp Durst. Oh yeah. Yes. Turn your back to the camera. Oh man, look at that. Very cool. Ooh. Yes. <laughs> I am tiny in that one. <laughs> look at them. Oh. Look at all them gold teeth. I'm like a quarterling. <laughs> a quarterling. <laughs> <laughs> average treasure fan, average trash enjoyer. I like mm -hmm. it. That's fair. That's fair. Trash enjoyers are chads. Oh, well, we know. got we got a we got another emote. Uh, Gek W. That's, That's cute. cute. <laughs> That's cute. <laughs> Not enough maliciousness. Some smell gore. Nice. Oh my man! Some more Stinkler. Stinkler, Stinkler! Yeah, fuck you! Yeah. Oh, oh man! I love the banana peel. That's nice. An old fish, mackerel. Mm -hmm. Video game donkey as the Goker. It's tail time. <laughs> it's <laughs> good album cover. That's very cool. Goker the movie. Based off of Gilgamesh and nothing else. <laughs> Sorry. Look at that jaw. That's a strong jaw. Mm. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Durst. Yes. Nice. Cute. Ah! Cute for sure. <laughs> I love that. Oh, I just love he just loves his coin so much. <laughs> the first dollar he ever made. Oh, we got ourselves an animatic. Oh, oh here we go. Oh, no. What? Uh -huh. New animatic. Here we go. Here we go. For a small price of... Sorry, one moment. Goker, do we... Do we... 300 doubloons. <clears throat> do, you, do you have 300 doubloons? We can provide that much. Well, it's just doubled now to 600. <laughs> Uh, sorry, sorry. One moment. One moment. <laughs> what are you? What are you doing? Why? Why? Why'd you double it? This is the art of the deal, Coots. Just watch. Uh, okay, okay, okay. Actually, good point. You know what? Uh, he's right. We've doubled it again. Twelve. Twelve hundred. You better. The, the, the clock is ticking. Very well. Twelve hundred. It is. Yes. Excellent. <laughs> if you wish to rest in our village, it will cost you six hundred gold. Yes. If you'd like, yeah, we can like take a... you on credit if you do not have it. It should be noted that loaning is a 25% upcharge. Stinkler feels like they're kind of destroying us right now. Do you have any good <laughs> argument here? What about 300 and no upcharge and no fee for staying here? For your audacity, 500. There are five of you, is there not? There's actually a six guy, but he's invisible. <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> Is that yes. Yes. That is so time. good. That's how you oh end that God. one. That's how you end that oh one. my God. That's, there's so much happening in this one. He's so beautiful. Yeah, he's real kawaii. Aww. Yeah, he's dreaming about his boys being like, you're 
You're the best. Traditional action shot. That's poggers. Nice. Yeah. Oh, the monkey. The monkey. monkey. The monkey's battle. Lost it. Maury's got that unlocked. There's the group oh, shot. My camera. Oh, oh that's a badass group shot. Hell mm -hmm. yeah. I like that Stinkler. I like Stinkler being like a cheery, disgusting Santa Claus. Yes, sir. Oh, man. Just bringing trash mist to all boys and oh, girls. Oh, damn. <laughs> That's awesome. We need Durst with the kill steal. <laughs> Bird. 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 <laughs> Mori. Bird is the word. Coots. Hmm? Yeah. Aww. <laughs> the That's so cute. Uh -huh. Mori Coots. You Durst. <laughs> yeah. Stinkler, Smelgor. <laughs> Collect them oh, all. That was very nice looking. That'd be a great figurine. My figurine would just be an attachment for Stinkler. Thank you. <laughs> it's an accessory. Yeah, I'm diamonds. an accessory. Oh my god. This coots looks sick. Yes. Wow. Oh, wow. Yeah. That's, that's like awesome. you have murdered someone that I love. Anger. When Mori eventually dies, he's giving that face. Yeah. Speaking of which. Ooh, that's yeah, Mori with the and... wings. Nice work yeah. on the wings. Mm -hmm. Mori in heaven. Yeah. <laughs> Remember. Another Mori. Nice. That is so cute. Really oh, cute. shit. Another animatic. Oh my we god. god. Damn, wow, wild. wow. You guys ever hear this the joke about uh, potatoes? Please tell me immediately. Uh, potato, tomato. <laughs> oh, oh, oh it, it is based upon the colloquialism of the word. How it is both the same but yet different. Look at it split. It's almost like that time that you tried to change your hair color. You mean when I wanted to be a blonde? Yeah, you wanted to be useless. Then you shouldn't say that. I am the chef, master of the... All right. We'll go back to... <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> All right. Oh, man. Where did that chef go? So good. Lost oh, fire. Sea. Miss. That is amazing. Oh, they colored it. I love really it. Lovely. Oh, put the hold on with the miss on the hat. Hang on a second. Yeah, Maury's definitely <laughs> redeemed himself. He had one bad. One I had one bad day. On, on, a, on a good day, it like new text appears that says he don't, and then it's he don't miss. <laughs> miss just playing. He don't. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, oh I love cool. the angles. Yeah. Where are your faces, Arcanum? Where are they? I'm not sure how you missed it, but the track's right in front of you. I'm not sure what you mean. <laughs> <laughs> that's that's super on brand. That's perfect. Oh my god, this is so cool. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, hey. oh. Oh not in his family for generations. Minutes even. Yeah. Holy shit. He we remembers the day he got it. We've got some calligraphy art. Oh, that's cool. Oh, nice. Nice. That is so hard to do. I could never. Maury covered in protective trash. Pen. Yes. Nice. That's cool. Mm, monkey. Stinkler monkey. armor is undefeated. I like monkeys. <laughs> yeah. You want to know how I got these scars? <laughs> Holy shit, somebody Look at that Oh, oh no That's a, guy of him. That's a whole ass figure Yeah Damn How'd they do that Skill, talent Carrying love. Mondays Love, art Nice Thank you Yeah Yeah <laughs> <laughs> Oh my it's god. Goku's world. 
Hey, kinds. Peter, I found this neat thing called the hey. Peter. <laughs> Peter. Found this uh, neat thing called uh, Bushido. <laughs> well, that's, uh, that's weird, there, Joe, because I am a ninja. Uh, nobody asked you, though. All right, cool. Moving on. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, that's cool. That looks like something you'd find in, like, old scrolls. Yeah. 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 <laughs> the, the legend of the trash man. So you yeah. got the Moss Burger Scrolls. Damn. Holy crap. He's so cool. He's always cool. I like that there was one cute one this time, though. There were there were a couple cute ones, actually. Oh, speaking of. Oh, uh, there we go. <laughs> Making a sand castle together? I think so. No, that's not sand. <laughs> that's trash. That's definitely trash. Oh, hey, trash look, castle. more branch pieces. Come look at that. Where'd you get those from? Wow, can you believe it? It's a miracle. Look at that. <laughs> <laughs> wow, they were just right there. I tried so hard. <laughs> Man, you did no. take the fall. I yeah. took no. I took the fall and gave up the branch. I was like, please don't hate us. Oh, I love it with the club. I like the wholesome smell gore. Somebody wrote a haiku for the cleansing of White Fury. Look to the east, beast. Observe how the sun rises. Cleanse and return form. I thought it was more of a Joe Swanson voice. Oh, that my bad. I <laughs> Excuse you. I apologize. Uh, hanging out with sexy dragons. Uh, lost at sea and uh, steel in silence. Nice. If I had a penny for every wild sorcerer with a big metal brick on a stick, I'd have two nickels, which isn't a lot, but it's weird that it happened twice. <laughs> <laughs> I'll see you guys. I'm out. <laughs> <laughs> Peace. <laughs> he failed his survival check. Yeah! He failed his. No. <laughs> Roll the one. Winkler, why? Well. I'm in a plane. Yeah. Aw. Dude, I'm so happy you got your kite today, by the way. Yeah, like, I was hyped. Especially because it's like the Avatar staff kite now. That's badass. Oh, I'm oh, hoping man. I get to fly more. Oh, that's cute. Oh, that's really cute. So cool. <laughs> Honorable yapping. So cool. Honorable yap. He's so cool. Hey, that's me. Oh, yeah, but you're very aggressive. Yeah. You're like, I'm about to come oh, out. Oh, no. You. Charlie's become too powerful. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we've we've branched out from Lost at Sea. Oh, yes! This is so meta. It has always been my power. Wait, if you die in the game, you die in real life. But if you win in the game, you win in real life. <laughs> True. Fine, I'll trash it myself. Oh no! <laughs> cool. <laughs> it's your finisher. Six million. That's your finisher scovels. line. Yeah. <laughs> Six million scovels. I'm out. Is that bathroom destroyed. No, I've only been able to fart. I can't shit. <laughs> oh, no. Your body's like, I reject. It's, it's getting sad. What you, gotta, what you gotta do is deny, 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 deny. Nice. Ooh. Mm. Uh, oh, I love the dynamic shot of that. Mm -hmm. My yeah. wife just butt dialed me. I'm a scare real quick. <laughs> 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 Durst the Cursed. Oh, my God. Oh, Jesus. Oh. You, you joke, but I'll show you guys an original drawing the artist originally did. I saw it and went, no, that's too, that's too frightening for children. Yeah, it's like that. What's that book? Uh, the scary books as a kid. Oh, go to fuck to sleep? Scary stories Where to read the in the dark. Are. Yeah, yeah, scary stories to read in the dark. Mm. Oh. These are two very nice, wholesome smell gores. Mm -hmm. Smell gore is wholesome. Get yeah. your uh, Goker aid. He's such a good lad. Goker aid. Monkey head. And a great uh, lay, apparently. I love, you'll mm -hmm. get a taste for it. <laughs> <laughs> oh my Monkey God. No morals. Santino. What? Ooh, okay. That's so, a great side so, profile uh, here. So, one of my, uh, one of the things my community also does is music. And I have a guitarist that's a part of my music community. And he does like a bunch of metal guitar and stuff like this. But apparently, he played. Uh, a, a Spanish guitar for the Goker. Oh, well, flamenco! Yeah, it's called El Goker. El oh. Goker. <laughs> here, let me, let me, let me, let me play this for you guys. All right, here we go.
my god, that was sick. Uh, Bro. You got <laughs> he your did that in an hour. <laughs> yeah, dude, he did that in an hour. <laughs> nuts. Go you are, you are nuts, my friend. There you go, Goker. Now you got oh, your own oh, uh man. now you got your your own theme. Yeah, and it plays so every time before he does his insult. <laughs> that was awesome. Every time the party lays down for a song of rest. Like I can't rest with my need to boogie. We never even use that salt. Wait, what? What is this? Is this another Does salt animatic? actually work on leeches? I thought that was a <laughs> another a animatic? No, oh. it's, I think it's only snails. Yeah, I thought oh it was God. snails. I didn't think it was leeches. Uh, all right, here we go. Okay. I may not look it, but I went to an art school, you know. And I stole like eight crates of acrylic before I tripped the alarm. <laughs> Anywho, what can I do for you, pal? You look like a fine up standing island representative. Holy shit, what? I do understand an <laughs> enterprise when they're presented. Is this TMCA? I don't know. I don't know what this is. I don't know what this is. What is this? I, Yo, I, I was digging it though. I was like, I, I was I ready for the go. I, I was ready for the sure Joker rap. That, yeah. Uh, oh, I, I just, was not expecting a rap about with Durst. Oh, I, I, I didn't think it was a Durst rap. Is it original? I did not realize that was a Durst rap either. Oh, what? a stipendium. Okay, I don't know if that's DMC or not. Oh wow. I'm gonna bail out of it, but thank you. Damn. Who? Ah, someone I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do. Where's the pizza? Oh. oh god. Did not go for the peach. Still... <laughs> <laughs> they takes, will kill us. Takes the frost giant strike. Oh <laughs> man. I can, yes. All of a sudden he's the same size as Mori. My like god. Taller, like Chopper in One Piece. Oh damn. Dude, you would be like Chopper. I just Absolute get joy. Yes! Oh, yes! oh Let's yes. Go! That's so cute. I love it. Dude, we're going to do so much flying together. I'm just jealous uh, of his hair. I wish I had Coot's hair. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Where's the music? <laughs> Chilling. I'm just chilling. Mm -hmm. Nice, nice, nice. You made me have to slice a bitch. Trade offer. The rest of my blood. A pizza. <laughs> <laughs> Durst in traditional art. Oh, hey, there you go. Oh, man, that's that's truly a terrifying face that Durst would have. Yes. He's so cool. That's at the peak of your sales pitch. Yes! The fucking bowed head and everything. We got what we mm. wanted. <laughs> <laughs> uh, no, it's not deep dish. It oh, is yeah. not deep dish. True. It's not yeah, Chicago's best. Suckers. Oh my god, what a sick As a man from like. Chicago, I yeah. can what you want? Are you in buttoning? Is it a show? No, I no, love no, that his I'm pants aren't even buttoned no, up. No, he ordered guys, he ordered the rock room, okay? This is the rock and the ladies coming afterwards. Oh, that's cute. Ooh, yeah. with the club. Young Stinkler. Nice. Yeah, that's innocent. That's yeah. pre <laughs> daily brothel visits. <laughs> Pizza. Uh, Goker, well, I, I trust like you. The Goker. Also, the Goker. <laughs> Goker, I trust you, Gokers. <laughs> uh, thought we are going to have to go. Dude. Oh my god. Oh, he killed Coots, you bastard. Battle shot. That's awesome. Oh, oh yeah. yeah! Oh yeah! That's that is badass. Oh, the perspective for everybody showing off different aspects. Ah, oh, this is good. Yo, the the killing goat. Compadre, esta no es una pizza. ¿Qué estás haciendo? We're we are like on a slow slide to someone just reenacting the entire killing of Jason Todd with Goker on Coots. Like we're getting there. Oh no. 
<laughs> Dude, Goku and I are going to have to fight them. Yeah. I will learn to fly. Yes. It's funny you Hell should yeah. mention Maybe. that. Uh, Coker, you, you what's with the do? Point? I have learned to fly. What's the what's with the crowbar? I did learn to fly. That's true. It took me four hours, which is crazy. Oh, I say, I make the joke. I make the joke. <laughs> Burn. Oh. Burn. Winning the <laughs> fight. Coker's plants. <laughs> oh, we dude, they really did that well, quick. And Goker was like, nah, chaotic, crazy. <laughs> in the bottom of the well. Yeah. Maybe he just wanted uh, us to feel how he felt. Yeah, Do you like cheese? I'm suddenly feeling a lot more like Jason than the Robin. <laughs> Accurate, though. Give me a pizza. Something personal, kid, coming in from behind. Just shaking in anger and rage. A monkey killed this tree, and no one else. <laughs> There's a sign. And deny sign. If it's written, it's true. Oh God, this is awesome. Smile, <laughs> bro. The test. What did you? What do you owe the monkey? Oh uh, yeah, we owe the monkey uh, bananas, right? Banana, I think. It is bananas. Okay. We'll never see him again. Yeah, go to the well, we gotta stop by, we asked him by the grocery the store. The last pizzas, bananas. Be everyone, Goker lied and deceived. <laughs> it's gonna be an intervention. I am not a pizza. This is funny. The worm yes. that walks. Look at how they massacred my boy. Fucking <laughs> <laughs> Marlon Brando. <laughs> now that is a pizza. Up. I don't know why they were so excited about me, but not the hey, other undead. I'm going to tell you I what, that I right there, that's, that's a fucking pizza. Dead meat, dead human. That's a that's nice maggot food. Yeah, that's a nice coots. Oh, yeah. I like the idea that my feet move so fast, I kick up dust in a circle. Or you landed. From <laughs> Tree's <high>. dead. <laughs> Tree's dead. Mari, Our Mari. Bad, I love that they had the sticks in the back, too. Yeah, I saw the little branches hanging out of yep. the trash can. It's like, I don't know what happened, man. It's crazy. Here's the I like one the idea of leeches not. smoking cigarettes. <laughs> Maybe we should say last rites. Amen. Nom, nom, nom. <laughs> Boy, I think these are banners they made for each of you guys. What? And chaos, laughter, and suffering. Pleasure. Mm. Wow. Soaring like ever higher. Family banners. In trash, we trust. Faith as strong as gold. Mm -mm -mm. Through duty, we find salvation. <laughs> the last lost at sea final boss. Oh, yeah. Oh, God. <laughs> Except it's just me there and Goku through me. <laughs> it really is like that. Ooh. Oh, wow. <laughs> That's nuts. That's real nice right there. I do like the idea of some yellow jacket. Yeah. That's not a pizza. <laughs> huh? Ah! Hey, yo, where's the pizza? You're the puppet master. Oh my God, it's Coots as Robin. Please. Yes, give it to me. Yeah. Ah, oh, give yeah. it to me. I would look good in that mask. Intense JoJo stomping. <laughs> That's what it was. Foolish Terran warrior. Oh. <laughs> Foolish Terran warrior. I'm gonna order a pizza. Get <laughs> 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 
another one's treasure, and I met a man who said that, but I like treasure. Magical girl. Oh, oh my yes. god. Give me the transformation. Give it to me. How could you do this, Goker? Madoka Smelgor. How could you? Swear to me. Accident. Swear to me. <laughs> my finger slipped. I guess that is our first try interaction of Batman, Joker, and Robin. And Robin, that's true. That was it. Was you chewing out the the Goker? The Goke. He's on thin ice right now. That was. Hmm. I see you, Donkey. <laughs> Alrighty, that like will conclude it. tonight's session and the fan art. Good thank you right. so much for having Hell us. Yeah. yeah, thank you. Thanks a lot for uh, playing blind. in my games, guys. Hell yeah. Four time next week. Next week. Cool. Yeah, and if anybody ever wants to play games, let me know. I, I'm, I'm down at any time. Uh, uh, yeah. yeah. Hey. Yeah. All kinds <laughs> of stuff, man. I gotta jump out here back to my stream. Yeah, yeah. I'll, I'll let you guys later. go. Bye, everybody. Bye, bye guys. Bye, bye everyone. That's it for me. Who loud, let me tell you. I am feeling it. Mr. Krabs. <sighs> All right, guys. I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. <laughs>